Mm. Okay. Bonjour, mes amis. Just gonna wait for some people to jump on and we'll get on this game. I know this is like the worst time to be streaming a game like this, but <laughs> I don't care. I need to stream something. Oh no. Fanky Ronald is calling shotgun. Someone else needs to call shotgun too. Okay. So we're on day six nine. I've updated this game since then and I still get a bunch of silver surfers attending this school. All right, let's see who's available. Uh, guess I'll bond with Kenji or Miyamoto. Let's see, I got Magician and I got Chariot. Okay, so how far did I progress their Confidant or Social Link, I mean? Okay, so seven. And where's Chariot? Oh, here's Chariot. So six. Uh, I'm not sure who I should progress more, the Magician or the Chariot. Um, I think I'll do Magician because at least I know I can gain personas I can resist fire attacks later on. Just uh, making sure that I give the best responses to him. I gotta go to a specific site here. Oh shit, I'm looking at the portable version. Not good, hold on. Okay, there we go. Reload version. And I think I was at rank 7 going on to rank 8, right? Um, hold on. Are you in trouble? Okay, and uh, you can say uh, you should go with her, or you should, two should talk it out. Um, you don't want to say this. This will not give you any points to his confidant, so just say one of the top two. There we go. So our main priority right now is to get um, the Hermit up as much as possible, because the Hermit is actually going to be the next... Um, Useful thing to level up. Alright. It's been a while since I played on this file. Over a month since I played on this file. So I might be behind on some of the stuff that is going on here. Alright. Anyways, uh... Can we go to the rooftop yet? I'm not sure if we're able to plant plants yet. I'm not sure. It's been a while since I played um, this game. So I might be a little rusty. Okay, so we got the man in suit who can be available. Um, <clears throat> how are we on our uh, social stats? Probably pretty terrible. No. Um... Okay, social stats. Okay, so we're three in every single social stat. In terms of what is more important, it's hard to say what's more important for us right now. Charm, courage, or academics. Um, I mean, I guess I could at least start uh, something with um, 
what's his name? The man in the suit. Good day. Ah, well, let's. I want to ask you out. Okay, darn it. Okay, so any more requests? Okay, so this one I can't get until much later on. Not that it matters because she gives me something completely useless for me. I still need to get the second document despite defeating the Empress and Emperor, but thankfully there's no deadline in collecting these old documents. Uh, defeat a total of 300 shadows for three beads and uh, fuse this chariot. Um, uh, chariot. Actually, I should have brought him with the chariot, darn it. Should have brought him with the chariot so that way I can at least get this achievement soon. Very well, then. Okay. And how are we on money? Um, okay, 82,000. That's not too bad. Let's see if we can sell anything. By the way. What do you got? Nothing, of course. All done here? Come back soon. Actually, one thing we should be making sure. I'm pretty sure I already stocked up on it on the... Sunday, but I gotta make sure that I am stocked up on it. I need to make sure I'm stocked up on SP drinks. Right. Okay, good. So I have six of these and twelve of these. And zero of those because I used them up uh, during the Emperor and Empress battle. But yeah, we'll definitely need those for when we do our Theurgy um, thing later on. Okay, so it seems like Shagalk, or not Shagal, not, no, that's not the place. Not yet, no, nah. It's been a while since I played this game, guys, I'm a little rusty. <laughs> right here. Aw, oh, darn it, I need to be more charming. Darn it, well, I'm charming, damn it. Okay, so it looks like I can't uh, work part-time yet. Okay, but it is a Tuesday night, so Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday nights. Oh, okay, I can work part-time. Okay, here we go. Yeah, we'll do that. Just raise our charm and courage. Because, yeah, I'm pretty sure we can't go um, into the next uh, block until uh, Fuka eventually joins us. Who's available? <clears throat> okay, Yuko is available, and so is the Emperor guy. Yeah, I guess I'll bond with the Emperor guy. Actually, do I have an Emperor persona? Let me just see. Uh, yes, I do. Okay. Alright, I just need to... Uh... Okay, Amber Social Link, Persona 3 Reload. I just gotta make sure that I'm. Okay, so Oberon, so here we go. Let's check him out. Okay, and then just see what answers that we need to give here. Some students think that the school uniform should be abolished and blah, 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 blah. They got a point. Sounds like nonsense. Obviously. One thing I hate about this social link is how you gotta practically kiss his ass, honestly, throughout this entire thing. Some students think the school uniform should be abolished, and they're gathering supporters. Yeah, and of course, you gotta say that sounds like nonsense. I would totally be all for abolishing um, 
you know, having, having uh, students be forced to wear uh, something so they can wear what they want. But throughout this entire social, like, you got to practically kiss his ass if you want to be supportive and on his side. Or at least uh, raise his social link efficiently. So, yeah. All right. So, bend, turn around. Bend over. Ass cheeks out. I'm kissing your ass. I hope you didn't wipe. Ugh. I hate the fact that I have to support him. Like that. I like the cracking can ASMR. What well, crackling can ASMR? Oh, okay. Here's some of the stuff that I bought from the shopping program, apparently. Alright, so we can't blue skidoo into Tartarus, right? Yep. What's going on on TV? Nothing. Alright, so, um... We need to raise our charm more, so let's go back to Polonia Mall and continue working that part-time job. Oh yeah, the VA for Yuko honestly made her probably one of my favorite social links to bond with, honestly. Alright, we're going to work part-time here so we can raise our uh, charm and courage. Sweet. All right, so Yamagishi has been released from the hospital today, so it looks like we're going to be seeing um, Fuka in the command center. Okay, so who's available? Okay, I think I'll do Miyamoto since there's an entire Elizabeth request around one of his personas. So I'm going to do him next. Alright, I just got to... Uh, change, uh, shoot, no. Sorry, my phone's being a pain in the ass, oh my god, um, Miyamoto, social link. I just gotta make sure that I give him the best responses, or the responses that he wants to hear. Alright. <clears throat> So, how's your knee? You have to get tougher. There we go. Gotta give him the best responses. Yeah, I'm actually recovering from being sick. I've had a strep throat recently, so I'm pretty much recovering from being sick, and yeah, it sucks having to deal with that. Okay, no Tartarus tonight. We got the Monk, who we could bond with, but uh, won't. Actually, do we even have a social link started with him? Out of curiosity? Um... Wait, do we even have a social link started with him? I don't think we do, so how is he available? That's weird. Uh, I don't think it should be indicated like that. I think it should have been indicated in, like a great card or something. Huh. Well, I mean, there's no one else that we can really bond with, and right now I can't work the part-time job at the... Um, Whatever. 
Who did you romance on your first playthrough? I romanced all of them. I don't know. I still haven't done my first playthrough because I just haven't really had time to play this game, honestly. Ah, uh, okay, I see. I need courage in order to bond with him. Got it. Okay, anyways, um, let me just see here. Let me, um... Uh, how can I pass time? Um, actually, I should see if Elizabeth has any more requests. Um, hold on. Because sometimes she won't have requests available until like a day or two after you have done a full moon mission. But let me just see. I'm looking for. Are you accepting a request? Okay. So it takes a, a certain amount of time before her requests become available, but yeah, right now I can't complete any of these. With the exception of maybe this, but consider that I'm level 17 and I, I gotta get a level 26 persona or higher. Yeah, it's gonna be a while before I can get that request completed. Alright. Eh, how should we pass time? Uh... Just raise my academics. And then once it's Sunday, I gotta pick up some more drinks. So Fuka is back, and the bully and her are gonna do the Why Can't We Be Friends down the hallway. Alright. Miyamoto is available, so I'm gonna bond with him more. Actually, can I deepen my bond with him more? Yes, I can. Good. Okay, and I still got the page open from when I was bonding with him, so... You must know what's going on, and um, apparently I can increase my bond more by being silent. I have a right to remain silent, damn it. Welcome back. All right, so, um, Tartarus now? No Tartarus? Guys, we gotta go to Tartarus. It's the best place we could possibly be at. Ah. Eh, still can't bond with the monk. Alright, someone subscribed. Thank you for subscribing, whoever subscribed. I don't know, is there anything worth getting here? Um, eh, not really. Okay, I already got the drinks from here. Yeah. Uh, I guess I'll raise my charm, I guess. I'll be honest, I've only had ramen once in my entire life. No joke, I've only had ramen once, and that was it. 
It was actually pretty good. It was pretty good, but um, it was not something that I could fully stomach yet. At least it was just too much um, for me to have all at once. Alright, how you doing, Veryls? And yay! Free EXP when we fuse death personas. Thank you, Pharos. Okay, so who's available? Um, only Yuko seems to be available, and then I got to deepen my bond with uh, Chihiro, so... Actually, who's available here? Oh, okay, it's Elizabeth uh, having more requests for us, isn't it? Alright, let's go see what she has. Marvelous. Yeah, I had like a friend of mine take me to a very authentic Japanese place out in Vancouver, and that was my... First and only time having ramen, and I had like a pork ramen. I'm looking for Here are my requests. Okay, there we go. So have a persona that is level 23 or higher for a sugar key. Nice. Most excellent. So now I could fuse Kane Frost. So yeah, this is the earliest possible persona that we can eventually fuse to get um, Ice Break. So if we want Ice Break, this is the earliest possible persona that we can get for Ice Break. Okay, and then five more Twilight Fragments for conducting 20 Persona Fusions or more. Okay, and I have a Rose Bouquet for just clothing, but I'll just complete it anyway. Alright. And uh, the three Jack Frost dolls, which I already uh, did beforehand, I'll just give it to her for some more Twilight Fragments. Okay. And then I have to conduct uh, 35 more Persona Fusions for more Twilight Fragments, so... Yep. Yeah. Brain of Fashionable Item. Hmm. I'm guessing this is maybe one of the... Uh, I know the triangular sword is uh, from Mitsuru. I'm not sure what the fashionable item was. But yeah, the triangular sword I'm pretty sure I get from um, Mitsuru. Alright, and then this one, bring me some potent medicine. So I just gotta go to Tartarus uh, once and then come back with the medicine for a steel pipe, so... I just gotta remember to go to the nurse's office after I went to Tartarus. And then come back and pretty much steal the medicine from him. Alright. Can I ask you out yet? No? Okay. Okay, what was I doing? Um... I was gonna bomb with either Yuko or Chihiro. Uh, let me just um, see um, where I am with them here. Um, hold on, where where are they? Okay, so I can rank her up, and oh wait, hold on, I haven't even started a social link with the Justice yet. Well, let me see if I can, because I'll do her over Yuko's. Alright, sweet. Okay, so... Doesn't matter what I say for the first ranks, thankfully. And there we go, we started our first rank with the Justice. Awesome. Alright. 
Girl talk. Oh, wait, is this where we do our theurgy uh, thing? Okay, at least I'm doing it on this night and not on the Sunday night. But yeah, this is where we're going to have to break uh, one of our rules, technically, because we have no choice but to attack during this tutorial. And I'm pretty sure we're going to be doing it tonight, right? Alright, here we go! Let's do this, guys. The Theurgy's tutorial. Hopefully we have enough SP recovery um, drinks from the vending machines for this. This is such a badass cutscene. I don't care if I get copyright claimed for this, I'll let it play out. Bam. Oh yeah, Cease is so badass. And yeah, I hope the audio is good guys, both the game audio and my audio. I mean, I might have changed the audio uh, since doing the Shimigami Tensei Nocturne um, streams recently. So if the audio is off, just be sure to tell me. Alright, the badasses are in the house. And yeah, even though um, I would prefer to leave Akihiko behind because he's kind of the least useful party member right now, um, we gotta leave Junpei behind, apparently. We gotta take everyone else with us, so but leave Junpei go. behind. Alright, so here we go. We got a bunch of weapons for every single party member, but we're probably gonna change them up. So let me just see, um... Uh, the Cease uniform we can keep on. The uniforms really don't mean anything to us. <clears throat> but yeah, now we got Mitsuru with us. So for her, we're going to give her the... Probably the Luck Band uh, for now. Because um, the the main use that we want for Mitsuru is for her to land her Marin Karens. That's essentially the biggest use uh, for her. For this um, entire run. For this entire run in general. Oh, excuse me. Oh, wait. Alright, so we're just gonna quickly check the weapons here. So, um, I'm gonna go back to the sword. No, I actually, no, I'm gonna go to this. Just for the extra endurance. And, um... Yeah, it doesn't really matter for Yukari. Go to this, um... For the endurance. Uh, it doesn't matter for Akihiko. And let me just check the body armor. Yep. All right. So I think I'm all good in terms of armor and such. And uh, while I'm at it, let me just uh, change the bead necklace to um, the pix pixie dust talisman, just so Fuka has the extra 10 SP because her SP is actually used in this run. Or used in this game. So what level do the girls start off at? Level 20. We're level 17. Yukari is 7. Junpei is 15. 15, 20. And 18. Wow. Okay, so let's see what uh, Mitsuru has. Okay, so she has Rakuna and Marikaren. These are the only skills that we're allowed to use. So we can't use our ice skills or any attack and skills, but both Rakunda and Marikaren are definitely going to be useful for this run. Wait, no. Now as for Fuka... Um... 
Uh, really not much yet until we get this ability. I mean, raising our defense and accuracy and evasion next battle will definitely be handy when we eventually get to that level, level 26, which is going to take a while. Okay, and let me just check my personas uh, and just um, see what's best to equip. So, Auto Tower Kaja. Um... Yeah, there's really not any good personas for us to equip right now. So I'll just equip Haru's persona for now. I want to use Mitsuru for Mara Karen. <laughs> yep. Exactly. The number one skill that everyone hates Mitsuru for is going to be the most useful thing in this entire run. Mara and Karen. We're actually going to put this to use. All right, can I add Junpei back in the party? <laughs> but I want Junpei back in the party, damn it. No, throw out Akihiko and give me Junpei, god damn it. You stupid ass game. Okay, fine. Hi. Okay, so how far... So, before we proceed up, we're gonna save, but I'll do a separate save just in case, or... I guess it really doesn't matter, because there's no way we're gonna be able to grind anyway for whatever we need, but, you know, I'll just do a backup save. Just do a backup save. Yes. So, we gotta defeat a certain number of enemies on one floor. And then we get the Theurgy tutorial on the next. And the Theurgy tutorial, we have no choice but to attack, unfortunately. And yeah, I actually got myself a different controller since the last stream. So it should be all fixed. Alright, let's do this. So, no attacking is our rule. And actually, maybe I should conserve using Makoto unless I absolutely need him. Hmm, let me see here. Yeah, I'll equip this guy for now. Guard. And ready, Mitsuru, you're finally up, baby. Mary Karen, your favorite move in the entire game. Oh yeah, you haven't lost your touch whatsoever, Mitsuru. Okay, so Tarunda will definitely be useful, but for now, Akihiko will mostly be used for healing. And uh, same thing with uh, Yukari, she'll be mostly used for healing too. So, Marin Karen, um, the other Sky Balance. And yeah, the upside with having um, Mitsuru using Marin Karen is that I can pretty much re save the SP use. I can save the SP use on Makoto for Tetrakarn and Makarakarn. Oh, crap, really? Alright, Mitsuru, I need you to do another Marin Karen soon. Okay. Uh, I'll stick with this guy for now. Okay, guard. Ailment recovered, god damn it. Oh, 
Ah, oh, darn it. Of course I wasted Merrick Aaron on that guy. Oh well. All right. There we go, Marin Karen. Oh my god, it only recovered instantly? No. I can't let afford you to do that, please, game. Okay, good time to heal, so heal main character. Well, so far, so good. <clears throat> okay, only one more left. Okay, I uh, just gotta switch to my um, Astarte Tetrakarn. All right, so far so goodish. Okay, now I gotta provoke the enemy, so... Uh, yeah, Rage Boost. So I'll definitely go with... Actually, no. No, I'll go with this. Um, there we go. Now hopefully it hits Makoto, which it probably won't, but we'll see. And of course it doesn't go with Makoto. The run is live, alive. First time um, uh, stream viewer. All right, sweet. And yeah, the run is no attack. It I cannot directly attack. Yeah, this is the problem with having a party of four, is that I can't get them to target Makoto. Come on, target me. This is going to be the pain in the ass part, is trying to get them to hit Makoto. Ah, of course, in the one time it does hit Makoto, it isn't enraged. Ah, whatever. Well, one more physical repel, and that should be it. But yeah, it's definitely a blessing in disguise that we have Mitsuru with us because we have someone that can inflict charm now.
There we go. Awesome. One battle done. I forget how much there is exactly um, on this floor. If there's like two or three or something, but... Oh, okay, two remain, so it's three. It, it, it's indicated in the upper right corner how many there's left. Ooh, Snuff Soul. Yes, okay. So we have an SP restorative that is not vending machine drinks. Although I probably want to save that Snuff Soul for, when, for the next uh, full moon boss. Hold on. Just want to make sure that I get all the mineral deposits around here. Yep, no attacking, and oh my god, that's a lot of enemies. Guard. Alright, Mitsuru, time to do your magic trick. Oh yeah, I'm so glad we have Mary and Karen with us. Whew. Oh crap, that you that can heal? I mean not so bad, but pretty bad. I wanna to try to avoid using SP recoveries uh, as much as possible. You beat a Persona 3 Reload about a week ago? Sweet. Ah, oh, rest in peace, Yukari. Ooh, nice dodge, Makoto. Thanks for the heal. Alright, so got enemies attacking each other, so let me revive Yukari. I need that extra meat shield on my team. Oh crap, element recovered. What's the, plan here? the plan is to marry Karen all of them. Oh no, it heals itself? Really? God damn it. If it heals itself, then that means I need to get the sky balances to kill the corrupt tower first. So the corrupt tower needs to die first, because if it heals itself, then that could put us in a soft lock. So we gotta have the corrupt tower die first. <clears throat> so 
So yeah, never thought I would do a run where Mary Karen would be so useful, but I'm so glad we have Mary Karen with us. Alright, Marin Karen. So I gotta focus on taking the tower out first because the tower can heal. There we go, tower dead. So now it's just the crosses or the sky balances. But yeah, so glad I got Mitsuru on the team. Just for Baron Karen alone. Alright, only one left, so now I have to focus on Tetrakarn. But yeah, so glad that I got uh, someone else I can inflict charm on the enemies now. So with Mitsuru on our side, we can conserve our SP a lot more. Nice, and I had a Rakuda on that too, so that was perfect. No, you gotta target Makoto, not everyone else. Let me just switch to a persona that I actually care about leveling up, so let me just see, um... Jack-o'-lantern, kinda... Eh... Uh, I don't know, I guess it really doesn't matter at this point. Yeah, gotta use some SP recovery drink soon. Now, I don't care if my party members die, because that means um, less targets for it to attack. Alright, there we go. Oh, level 18 already, sweet. And we're level 8 with Yukari, which is no surprise considering she's severely underleveled. Ooh, Palimpa, a skill we can actually use, but it's not really going to be that useful for us, honestly. Oh, hello. <sighs> Alright, there we go. Let's do this. Alright, so that, I think, just buffs our attack power, which is not going to be that useful. Unless someone, um, or unless a uh, Tartarus boss uh, does some sort of inflict rage um, ability, then that might be useful. We see them. Let's take these guys down. Time to finish this. Okay, so the last enemy is there, but I'll deal with him in a little bit. Ah, oh, sweet. Twilight Fragment. Awesome. And can I ignore the enemy? Of course I can't. 
Okay, so I explored every part of the floor, so I just need to defeat that one shadow. But I think I need to use some of the SP drinks on um, Mitsuru and Makoto in particular. Or maybe... Actually, no, I should probably at least use some of it on Makoto because I don't have a soul drop. So, uh, let's see, what can I waste? I guess the Mad Bull... That should be good enough for Makoto. Um, actually, should that be good enough? Um, okay, 24 times 3. Uh, that'd be about uh, 72, I think. Yeah, that should be enough for Makoto. I'll just add a few more onto uh, Mitsuru, and that should be good. And I'll just use Yukari's uh, healing skills to fully heal everyone. There we go. I should be able to fight the uh, the shadow now. Okay. Let's do the crosses because they can get a one more off of the middle guy. Uh, Fuka joined the team. Poggers, yep. Um, let's see. Um, wait, uh, is spirit or health drain ability allowed? Spirit drain is allowed, but health drain is not. And unfortunately, spirit drain cannot be learned until like level 30-ish or whatever. Although the one skill that I am aiming for is Invigorate 1, which I can get off of Naga, but I gotta level Naga up to level 22. Which is like its last skill, and it's a Hermit Persona, and I don't have the Hermit maxed or anything. Oh, bad damage. Oh, insta-kill, nice. So glad I didn't Marin Karen that enemy. Alright, let's play like uh, Mitsuru does in Persona 3 Fast. Marin Karen, every living thing she sees. Alright, so far so good, progress-wise. But yeah, I think after these this battle, um, we pretty much have a force battle on the next floor. Gotta get Marin Karen on this next, on this guy. So yeah, this is the Marin Karen run, guys. The Marin Karen run where Marin Karen is actually useful. Okay, I think I used up too much of the SP recovery drinks, but that's okay. That's honestly okay. Alright, so one more hit, and then that should be it, and then I just gotta put Tetrakarn onto Makoto, and that's it. I'm pretty sure I don't even need a Rakunda. But I'll put Rakunda on him just in case, because I'm pretty sure I won't be using Mitsuru for the rest of the day. Mm -hmm. 
All right, now it's just a matter of it hitting Makoto and not everyone else. This reminds me if you're doing nothing run on Persona 5 Royal. Oh, don't remind me. Unfortunately, it kind of is, but it's both better and worse in the same ways. All right, done. Alright, so I got through the uh, three mandatory battles on this floor. Okay. Okay, Yukari's in trouble. And this is where we get our Theurgy tutorial. Bullshit, I have counter. Not again. Everyone's always protecting me. I'm getting hurt because of it. What am I even doing? Yukari Chan! Fuka, I need you to back me up. I'll hold this thing off until everyone else gets here. Well, that's it. Yukari is kicked out of our team. She just attacked, guys. Yukari is so kicked out of our team. So, Theurgy activation, so when emotions run high in battle, you or your party members will be able to activate Theurgy. Alright. So, we got no options here, guys. So, yeah. We can press Persona, Item, Guard, or Attack. We have no choice but to do this. This is tutorial, so this obviously will not break the rules of our run. But this is the only attack-based Theurgy we'll be using in the entire run. So deal severe wind damage to all foes. And there's no way out of it. But yeah, considering that Yukari has already attacked beforehand, whatever, let's let her do her thing and then we'll punish her later. So that's the only time we'll ever use Yukari's Theurgy. So now we gotta severely punish her for using, for attacking an innocent shadow. But yeah, out of all of Makoto's uh, Theurgies, there's literally only one that will be useful in the run, and that's Condensa. The one that you'll get no matter what, since you're forced to get both, um, Orpheus and uh, Absaurus, uh, no matter what. <coughs> Jeez. So all allies can use Theurgy, and unfortunately the only allies that we're going to use Theurgy with is Fuka and Cadenza with Makoto. That's it. Everyone else has an attack-based Theurgy, so Theurgy is pretty much going to be maxed on everyone except for Makoto and Fuka. And Ken. Ken is the other one that's going to be useful once he gets his ultimate persona. Okay, and I'm pretty sure that's just the... No, I'm going to ignore you guys because I got to bond with the Hermit. I got to get um, Invigorate 1 as soon as possible. Alright, so I guess we can save. 
So unfortunately, that was an instance where we have to attack. But since it's tutorial, then that's um, then that's really uh, not really a big deal, honestly. So let's uh, get some sweet stuff. Okay, a brand watch and a mega protein. Yeah, I think we can skip on that. Okay, and before we bond with the Hermit... Oh, actually... Um, can we actually uh, complete one of the requests now? Let me just see. Yeah, any charge or concentrate skills, while useful in theory, is going to be useless in this run. Like, it's not a rule breaker, but it's going to be useless. And I'm pretty sure there's no SP recoveries here. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, I'm pretty sure they're in the lobby or whatever, or the lounge. Ah, here we go. So yeah, this is the triangular sword request. go. I'm so glad that you can get these anytime and not have to wait until late in the game to get it. Okay, so let me just get the other SP recovery drinks. There we go, more SP drinks on us. Now, let me just see if I have a Hermit Persona on me. Which I don't, so I need to go to the Velvet Room. Oh boy. I definitely got youngsters arguing who's best girl. Who cares? Alright, there we go. We got some sort of evasion equipment. Protein for pro, so I'm pretty sure I gotta talk to Akihiko for this one, which gives me a spike bat. And, uh, what was this one? The look fashionable one? Uh, bring me a stylish item that would look good on me. Uh, where the young and trendy gather for a good time. I forget where to get this. I mean, it doesn't really matter because a power incest is not useful for us. It's rather blinding. I mean, a power incest is not going to be useful for us, but where do we get the fashionable item again? If anybody remembers where to get the fashionable item, just be sure to tell me, um, uh, just be sure to say in the, uh, comments. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'll, I'll worry about, uh, getting the Hermit Persona a little later. I just gotta... Go and get the protein from Akihiko, give it to her, and then if anybody can tell me what the uh, fashion request is for, um, I'd like to know. Okay, spike that. Good. Okay, so what was the fashionable item again? I don't remember what the fashionable item again is. Fashionable item is available in the club. What club? What club are you talking about? Have you gotten used to battling with a persona? Very well.
Oh wait, are you talking about Club Escapade? Because I do remember completing a request in Club Escapade in particular. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I gotta fuse the Hermit Persona. I need to do that. Hold on. Nightclub, the glasses. Oh, okay, so that's the uh, fashion thing I need to get. All right. Oh, here we go. So we got uh, two Theurgies here. And unfortunately, Jack Bros, which would have been useful if it used the fast version, because in the fast version, um, it actually only had a high chance of inflicting down, but it didn't have the almighty damage. Um, but because it has the almighty damage, we're banned from using Jack Bros. Unfortunately, the only Theurgy that we can use with Makoto is pretty much Cadenza. That's it. So pretty much given the Masu Kakaja with a 50% heal and that's it. So it doesn't... So fusion skills are not gonna matter considering that we can only use one of them. Registering, I see. Alright, register all. Persona you desire, is it not? Yep, I require a hermit. What kind of persona do you desire? So Naga, this is the guy we need. So we gotta get his very, very last skill. And unfortunately that's gonna be a problem considering that his very last skill, well, let's just say we need a bomb with the hermit as much as possible so we can reduce the amount of grinding. But this is the persona, or the earliest persona we can get in Vagrate 1 from. So we're going to bond with the Hermit as much as possible during this, this moon cycle. And then whenever the last opportunity to bond with the Hermit is, we're going to use that opportunity to level up um, Naga as much as possible until we get in Vagrate 1. Uh, do I really want to fuse this guy? Probably not. No. Please take a look. You can't carry any more than that. Ah, crap! Really? Are you Please choose the personas you would like to fuse. Uh, who can I fuse away? Can't really fuse anyone away because they're all overpowered. Principality is an option, I guess. Um, Naga, of course. Okay, so Devil, Hermit, um, I mean, I guess the Devil is an option. Crap. I mean, I don't really need a fool persona on me, and temperance I don't really use at the moment. Seeing what personas come to be is a great joy of mine. Huh. This would be a wise choice. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out who I should fuse here. You know, I'll just do this and then just buy the cherry because I'm not going to need the temperance on me. This would be a wise choice. I'm only fusing this guy just so I can get uh, a skill that I need. Or, or just so I can have the persona, that's it. Counter. Um, provoke. Rage boost. Uh, fire break. All right. But yeah, I'm not sure what rank I need to get uh, the Hermit at in order to get um, Invigorate 1. But yeah, somewhere after the Eerie Sound skill is Invigorate 1. So if I can get the Hermit up as many levels as possible and fuse Naga again, then I'll be at least close enough or have just enough to get Invigorate 1. Because once I get Invigorate 1, I'll have the best possible skill that I can use. This is your progress so far. 
All right, let me just rebuy that cherry persona. All right. Okay, so now let me just go and bond with the hermit. Okay. So I can't go to Club Escapade right now, so right now I'm just going to go back to my room and bond with Maya. Okay, hold on. And uh, what rank am I at with her? Hold on. Okay, I'm rank six. Okay, so six to seven. All right. Well, yeah. She, um, what? All right, so I have three more possible ranks with the Hermit, but I pretty much want to get the Hermit up as much as possible before I fuse Naga again, because I want to get the Invigorate 1 skill, because that's the earliest I can gain a skill that will pretty much be a passive SP restorative option for me. Okay. So we can jump into Tartarus now? Yes, we can. Sweet. Alright, so let me just see who's around here. Um, okay, Sunday. And uh, tomorrow is school, right? Actually, no. Let me go to Club Escapade first uh, because I gotta see if I can get the fashionable item. Yeah, it's from this guy. Okay, so if I could get the black quartz, if I could even get that. We got some. Or I could gain just a crap ton of yen and buy it just from that. So I don't need to get the item per se, but um, yeah. So let me just see, am I going to school tomorrow? Uh, looks like I am going to school tomorrow, so I'm gonna jump into Tartarus because once I go back to school then I can get the medicine for the other request. So in the meantime, we're gonna boost our Theurgy. So Soul Fortune. And we're gonna get the Soul Fortune which increases the chances of Theurgy, Theurgy gauges to charge. Which means we'll be able to use Condensa more often with Makoto and uh, use Fuka's um, ability to either heal or restore SP. So this is going to be an incredibly overpowered and useful. Alright. So Theurgy's gauges will charge faster, so that's exactly what I want, and that's going to be incredibly useful for us. Okay, so I asked her about it, so anything I can complete in the meantime, so 34 or 35 Persona Fusions for more Twilight Fragments. So I think in the meantime, I just need to make more progress in Tartarus. And in terms of party members, I'm going to use Junpei. Oh, I can't add um, anyone to the party right now, but I'm going to have Junpei and Mitsuru with me. So I'm going to... Make sure that everyone has the best possible equipment on them. Uh, let me see. Okay, an extra 10 HP. Okay. Sandals, um, resist fear. <laughs> I guess I'll equip that onto Makoto just for a better evasion at least. 
Still got the rain on him. Okay. And now let's go buy some better equipment. By the way. What'll it be? I got some stuff you might oh, wait. use for. What'd you bring? Wanna sell? All right. I'll take that. Okay, hold on. Uh, let me see. Well, what was it? Um, okay, fancy nails. I'll take that. And I think it was the bead necklace. I'll take that. All right. So let me see, um, okay, it's pretty much the endurance and the 10 HP that I need. Reduce fire damage, that could be useful. I have no idea what you're fighting out there. Just don't get in over your heads. Okay, so a, an extra agility for her, so yeah, I'll get that. Um, an extra 10 HP. Actually, no, I'm not going to use Akihiko, so screw Akihiko. Hmm. I mean, the all-purpose katana could be useful for the extra luck, but... Okay, so I'll get the reduced fire damage, because I know the next Tartarus Guardian will do fire damage. Yeah, I'll sell that. So I'll sell the toy bow. Okay. Armor. Don't sell. That what you want? All right, then. Sell. Mitsuru, uh, let me see. Um, Everything All right, then. And then Junpei. That what you want. All, right, then. All right, thankfully I have enough and oh man, the all-purpose apron, all stats plus one. That could be useful, so I won't sell that. Actually, I, I, I believe I got extra footwear. Did I? I'm not sure if I changed the footwear. Let me just see. Okay, yeah, I did just change the footwear. Okay, well, let me see if there's better footwear. Good to see you. Okay, footwear. Some stuff you might find useful. So All right, uh, confuse boost, distress boost. Um, okay, if there was charm boost, this would be useful, but unfortunately, there's no charm boost. Yeah, darn it. Okay, footwear. Everything good here. Second thoughts. Okay, combat boots, more evasion, so we'll get that. Don't sell. I have no idea what you're fighting out there. Just don't get in over your heads. Electricity evasion low. That might actually be a lot more useful for Yukari. That what you want? All right, then. And I'm out of uh, yen because, of course. What do you got? Wait. Sure now. Alright. I'll take that. Alright, let's see. What else do we got? Um I'm sure now. Alright. I'll take that. Oh, we got a lot of guard bands. Holy crap. You're sure. It's a deal. And a lot of speed bands too. Holy crap. It's a deal. How many are you selling? You're handing. Alright. I'll take that. Okay, should be enough to get another piece of footwear for at least one other person. Hmm. I guess I'll have June pay with it. There we go. Okay, unfortunately I don't have enough yen to get better evasion equipment for Mitsuru, but that's okay. That'll do for now. Alright. <clears throat> and um, actually, let me just go to the shop here. 
I already got the SP drink, so I don't need to worry about the SP drinks. Uh, let's see, um... Okay, we got a crap ton of medical powder. Uh, let's see. How many? I guess we can only get one of these. Nope. Yep. Alright, time to jump into Tartarus. So we pretty much just want to go to Tartarus just to see how far we can get, but also to make Makoto fatigued a little, so that way we can get the medicine from the um, nurse's office. Okay, let's go into Tartarus. Alright, so we got um, the Emperor and Empress uh, Major Arcana card, so the Empress increases the Endurance, Agility, and Luck, so the Empress, Empress will be useful, and the Emperor increases the Strength and Magic, which is not going to be useful, but we have to attain it anyway if we want to get um, the Arcana Burst. Oh, hold on, let me just um, add uh, my party to the party here. So Mitsuru and Junpei... Sorry, Akihiko, but you're staying in the back lines whether you like it or not. <coughs> oh, <geez. coughs> so I gotta see if I could. I gotta see if I could even have a shot at. Uh, so we have backup, or anyone who and don't forget what happened. I'll leave it up to. I'll do every. Okay, so changing party members, we know all this stuff. So um. Actually, before I go in, maybe I should go through Thebel first, just so I could get a few soul drops, just in case. Just in case. Maybe I should go through Thebel first, because at least I know the enemies will avoid me if I go through there. Yeah, I'll go through Thebel first, just so I could pick up some soul drops if they happen to spawn in any chests. So, this is going to be a while, guys. This is going to be a while. But you know what? The grinding is going to be a lot more smoother from this point going forward. Yep, this is where we started exploring the tower. So, yeah. We just got to hope that we get a soul drop or two from here. And even if we don't, at least we're getting some uh, things that we can sell. Like some feeble materials that we can sell. But yeah, I'm definitely not going to miss exploring the Ebol, that's for sure. <sighs> All right, let's get going. Interesting. This area still bears some resemblance to the school. I'm pretty sure you've already explored this, Mitsuru. I know you have. You liar. Okay. So yeah, hopefully we get a soul drop or something around here because that's the whole point of me going through Thebel is it's just for that rare chance that I get a soul drop. Looks Speaking of Tartarus, am I the only one who enjoys these kinds of game dungeons crawling more than social life uh, sim? Uh, I don't know. Um... Honestly, one thing I love about Persona is how it has that half-and-half -half social life simulation, as well as, um, uh, the dungeon crawling. I mean, that's what I really like about Persona, is that nice change of pace between, uh, two different styles of gameplay. And both are done very well, and both complement one each other, one, one another. Like, all the social sim stuff that you do affects, um, your performance in the real world, or in the, um, supernatural world. Okay, another medical powder. Good, we'll need that. Hey, hit the stairs. All right. Later. Do you think two pieces of gum counts as breakfast? No, it doesn't. All right, theurgy's gauge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. My 
But yeah, right now I'm just going through all the Thebal just so I can gain some materials and hopefully a soul drop or two. There's a treasure chest. Lifestone, not as useful, but it's going to be useful. Hey, let's move that chest. And hey, at least I'm gaining money from these chests too, so it's not a complete waste of time going through these blocks. But yeah, pretty much all the party members that we have here are going to be useful to us in some way. So Yukari for healing, Mitsuru for reducing enemy defense and using Marin Karen, and Junpei for counter. So essentially all these party members are going to be useful one way or another. And, of course, Makoto for his versatility in battle. I guess it's like lighting in the darkness, you can't have one without the other. Very true. Valuable chest, so hopefully that's a um, medical powder. Because medical powder is definitely going to be useful. You might end up face to face with a shadow. Okay, more yen, good. More yen the better. A shadow. What will you do? Oh, I will give it a hug, Mitsuru. That's what I will do. We found the stairs. Let's go. A shadow. What will you do? Why are you navigating? Let Fuka navigate, damn it. And Fuka, you better allow me to escape battles when I want to escape battles. Unlike Mitsuru, who wanted me to stay in battles for as long as freaking possible. It seems like we've checked okay, medical powder, good. I need that more than escaping from a battle. Okay, let me just check and see if there's any deposits up here. No, I believe I got everything here, so... Next floor. Hey, do you think Persona 3 Reload will come to the Switch or no? I mean, I hope it does for those who will play on the Switch. I mean, for the sake of um, having a system to play on, I do hope it does come out for Switch users. Don't worry. At this time, I'm still getting clear readings from all of you. Uh, Fuka, we're on the Thebal. We're at the lowest possible part of Tartarus we could possibly be at. Of course you can read where we are. On muscle. A shadow. What will you do? <laughs> Give it a hug. That's what we'll do. <laughs> Check out that fancy chest. Yeah, we're not opening up a log chest, thank you very much. Okay, I don't think I got a single soul drop at this all, but that's all right, as long as we're gaining materials to sell and, of course, extra money from chess, that's all that matters. Okay, next floor. But yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can beat the next Tartarus Guardian. If not, then I just gotta level the Hermit up more. That teleporter can take us to the entrance. Try to remember where it is. Hey, there's a treasure chest! 
Okay, another odd Mersal, cool. But yeah, hopefully we don't have to grind in Thebal any more longer because it'd be nice not to have to grind too much. On Mersal, yeah, not get in a single soul drop here. Hey, there's a treasure chest. Eh, <sighs> no soul drops. Oh well. So this is where the stairs were. A shadow. It seems like we've got everything on this floor. Understood. <sighs> oh, there's a treasure chest. All right. A log chest, so I'm definitely not going to get that. That teleporter can take us to the end. Try to remember where it is. <clears throat> Look at it. Running around like a clown. <clears throat> I don't know, maybe there's a Garu skill card or something in there. <sighs> Definitely not gonna get it. Oh, can we go up those stairs? No, I just want to activate it as a fast travel point. But yeah, Mitsuru is still trying to navigate even though Fuka is doing a fine enough job as is. It's like she can't uh, resist having to navigate even though she, she, she misses her job. Uh, if only I could defeat this guy. If only I can defeat this guy, but I can't. That sucks. I wish I could defeat a rare shadow, and trust me, we've tried. We tried using provoke and repelling a raged, uh, 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 whatever shadow, and yeah, it just didn't work. Alright, at least we got a Twilight Fragment from this. All right, another rare one. Power bands for me to sell. <coughs> Jeez. Cure water, not as useful, but will still be useful. Oh man, a lot of mineral deposits here. Excellent. Looks like we can head up. There's a treasure chest. Okay, and I'm pretty sure I did not explore all this floor, so let me just explore all the floor before I go up. Yeah, there's a section I didn't explore. Yay! Ugh. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Locked one, so can't get that. I mean, I can get that, but it's useless. Yeah, I doubt we'll have any trouble in this area either. Weak enemies and they're all scared of us. One teleporter sighted. It'll take us back to the entrance, but I'm down to keep 
But yeah, I'm pretty sure once we enter Arqua, um, all the enemies are gonna fear us again. Or not fear us, they're not- they're gonna run away from us because we're severely underleveled. Now, we have Junpei with us. Hey, let's move that chest. A shadow. What will you do? Oop, I spy some treasure. Power bands. At least I'm getting get, gaining stuff that I can sell. Because I'm definitely going to need a lot of money. Not just to get the best evasion and defense equipment for everyone, but also so I can um, purchase the fortune readings or the soul readings, whatever it's called. Revival bead, um, still pretty good that we're gaining some things that are still going to be useful for us. Medical powder, good. Okay, everything on this floor, done. And here we go, we've made it to Thebel. But let's just continue going up. We're gonna continue going up. And we're gonna see if the enemies fear us or if they're gonna attack us. Hey, let's loot that. We got ourselves a shadow here. So are the enemies going to fear us or attack us? Okay, they're still going to attack us, so yeah, we're still severely underleveled. There's a treasure chest. What should we do? Okay, more yen, awesome. And yeah, we have a chance of getting soul drops from these mineral deposits. Not dying is the plan. Man, these... A lot of flares. A lot of purple flares when you run in front of those things. I hope it's not too disturbing for you guys. <clears throat> Locked. Not gonna be useful. I mean, how many Twilight Fragments do we get? Because we actually used up a lot of it last time we were here. 17. That's actually not so bad. That's like two uses of the clock. And yet, impressive in a way. Yeah, we're just gonna explore all of Arqua, just pick up any soul drops that we get from the mineral deposits, and work from there. Yeah, we're not gonna get it. Okay, soul drop. Good. Alright, so we're just going to keep going up until we reach uh, the Tartarus Guardian that I haven't passed yet. So this shouldn't take too long. But we're going to try... We're going to try to beat the Tartarus uh, Guardian that we couldn't get past before. Because now that we have like the Theurgies and um, Fuka's ability to recover SP... With them, we might be able to have a chance up against uh, the Tartarus Guardian that we couldn't face up against before. Actually, how is everyone's levels, by the way? Okay, Makoto, um... Huh. I mean, I could probably level up, um, 
Akihiko at least once before I leave. Just so he's up at least one level. Yeah, you're getting a lot of skill cards within this block. So please watch your step. Ooh, maybe there's something nice inside. Cure water, not as useful, but still useful. Let's see. Careful, the enemy's nearby. Oh boy. Disappear. Oh my god. Ah. Uh, disappear, you stupid shadow. everything Hope we don't run into any creeps here. yeah I forget which floor the Tartarus Guardian is on I mean I, I should know because and I spent hours but time we come here, but it's still vexing hey, there's a treasure chest. Gale earrings cool not gonna use them All right, here we go. So this is the this is our limit. So we still need to beat the Tartars Guardians that are on this floor. So floor twenty eight is the furthest that we've gone. So we didn't even defeat a single Tartars Guardian that was on um, floor or that is in the Arqua block at all. Okay, so for all that grind, we only got one soul drop, but that's okay. That's all we need. So snuff souls. Even though we do have snuff souls, I want to. Conserve the four biotics and the snuff souls for when we eventually face up against the upcoming uh, bosses. So, we're gonna give the next Tartarus Guardian a shot and see if we can beat him. Let's do it. All right. All right, let me just see here. Um, I guess I'll put Tetra card onto Makoto just for a start. All right. Um, and yeah, we can't Marigarin any of the enemies. Um, in fact, I'll show that we can't but yeah charm does not work on these guys which is why I haven't got past them yet rest a piece okay and we're gonna get fire break at the ready. Um, I guess we'll go with this guy. Fire break. And then get Makarikarn on Makoto soon. Cause yeah, the first enemy that attacks, attacks with fire damage. Attacks with fire damage, which means if I repel the fire while fire break is active, then I actually have a chance of being able to defeat this guy. Uh, defeat the middle guy first. Uh, 
All right. All right, so far so good-ish. So we got Fire Break active, and we also got Tetracarn active, so we're going to put Makara card onto Makoto. And, and actually, we should analyze with uh, with Fuka, because if we analyze with Fuka, then we're able to get... Um, then we're able to... Uh, hold on. Where's the analyze? Oh, there here we go. Will-O-Wisp, so let's analyze... Ice, okay. But yeah, doing that will increase our theurgies and god damn it, Creative Cloud, stop getting in the way. Okay. But I gotta keep the fire break active. Okay, that worked. Good. So I can repel the electric, no problem. It's the fire that's the problem. But with fire break, that shouldn't be a problem anymore. And with Fuka being able to restore SP, then that shouldn't also be a then that shouldn't be a problem. Okay, so Fuka is pretty close to leveling up or getting uh, close to. Uh, yeah, we'll probably not analyze until after we uh, have done her first theurgy. Okay, so I need to switch to someone for um. Uh, let me see here. Okay, fire break. Oh wait, I gotta put up some. Gotta put gotta put up a more car car, and I just realized. Not dying, that's the plan. We came prepared. What's this? All right. All oh, right, because uh, using her healing increases. So yeah, Yukari is going to be maxed very soon here. Okay, so I got to put uh, Makara card on me because I don't have, because I have Tetracarn, right? Oh, I don't have Tetracarn. Well, let me just put Makara card up because I know I got Fire Break up. Awesome. Theurgy, so severe ice damage, so I can't use Theurgy at all with Mitsuru. So she's going to be maxed from this point on for the rest of the game. I gotta get Tetracarn and Makarakarn up. And there we go. So now I got uh, Yukari's Theurgy maxed, and she's gonna be maxed for the rest of the run. Uh, I guess I'll. Uh, no, I'll do Tetracarn first, and then I'll use uh, Fire Break, and then Makara Karn. Oh, crap. I guess I shouldn't have. 
I'm already regretting my decisions. The time is right. But yeah, I should be able to beat this uh, fight without a problem. But I do have to restore SP, which sucks. But that's why I increase the chances of Theurgy gauges filling faster. Actually, if I let Yukari die, then um, I could decrease the chances of Fuka. Huh. Actually, no. Okay, Fuka is nearly full, so I gotta wait until she's more full, and then I use Theurgy with Makoto. Hmm. Okay. I guess, uh, Makarakarn. Actually, no, not Makarakarn. Fire Break. Okay, here we go. Fire Break. Ah, uh, hold on. Alright. Okay, Fuka, how close are you to your Theurgy? Not yet. But I gotta use up my SP so that way Fuka does use the SP recovery. Alright. So I got Fire Break active, so. Oh no, 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 don't one shot, Jesus Christ. Okay, so I got the physical shield up, so magical shield, and I gotta keep the fire break active. Cure water. All right, so we're actually making progress in this for once. Try harder. Nice dodge. Okay. And, oh, I'm out of SP. God darn it. I gotta get Fuka's uh, Theurgy suit, guys. Crap. Come on. Come on, Fuka. I need your Theurgy very, very soon. Yeah, this fight's gonna take forever. <sighs> but yeah, we're, we are making progress, but we're not even halfway through the darn fight. Okay, 
Okay, Fuka, are you close? Please be close because I need the SP recovery very, very soon. Actually, let me just check something. Makoto uh, has the physical shield up, so... Okay. Because uh, I should probably switch to a Persona with counter if he loses that physical shield. Yeah, before I use Fuka's Theurgy, I gotta make sure everyone's fully healed, so that way I can make sure that she focuses on Restored SP, because Restored SP is what I need from her. Uh, hold on. So I gotta use as much SP as possible with every other party member. Come on, Fuka, we need your Theurgy. Alright, there we go. So I used up uh, both our Tetra card and Makara card, so we gotta get SP recovery from Fuka soon. Yeah, we gotta hope that she recovers our SP and nothing else. So I gotta switch to a Persona with Counter here. Uh, who has Counter? As well as a Repel or... I, or whoever... Let me see, um, Counter... Um... And whoever resists or blocks uh, electric and fire. Okay, it seems like this guy is my best bet, so I'm gonna go with him. Go with him. And now I just gotta keep guarding until Fuka eventually ga gets her Theurgy. Once she gets her Theurgy, we just gotta hope that she recovers SP. But we also gotta make sure that everyone is healed before we do... Um, before we use her Theurgy, because we got to make sure that she recovers SP. Block, nice. Okay, there we go. Alright, but before she could use it... Okay, Makoto is next. Okay, that's not a full heal. So we're going to use Makoto's Theurgy here. So this is the only Theurgy we're allowed to use in the entire run. So a 50% heal and an all party of the uh, accuracy and evasion up. Crap. So we gotta make sure we fully heal with everyone before we use uh, Fuka's Theurgy. So we gotta make sure that we're fully healed. Okay. Okay, Makoto is next, so we're gonna use up um y Yukari's SP. Which we can't. And I'm pretty sure Palimpa doesn't do anything. Hmm. 
Let's see, um, yeah, nothing we can use. So we'll just guard with her. And then use Oracle, and hopefully she restores SP, because that's what we need. And I already did a old party agility up, so hopefully she doesn't do an old party heat riser, so let's do it. Good. Thank you, Fuka. Thank you, Fuka. That's exactly what we needed. Okay. Good. So, Fire Break and then Makara Karn. And while we're at it, let's analyze the other enemy. This is just to increase her theurgy. No idea how long we've been in this battle, but we might be in here for quite a while. Okay, Makara Karn. Alright, so all our party members are maxed on their theurgies, and we cannot use them. Okay, so we can't scan anymore. So unfortunately, we're gonna have to go out of snail's pace to get Fuka's theurgy all the way up to restore SP. So it's pretty much just an endurance battle, essentially. Let's see, we'll go with, uh, counter. Guard. Might need to use fire break again. Oh, was that a counter? Or no, that was a that was a Makara Garn. Darn it. Eh, shoot. Yeah, this might take a while, guys. Actually, do I have enough uh, Makara Karn and then how much uh, for a Fire Break? 12. Uh, 12, uh, so that's um, 36. Okay, so I do have just enough, so I'm going to use a Fire Break and then one Makara Karn. No, not with Slime. Naga. Fire Break. And then use one Makara Karn and then I just got to rely on Counter, essentially. Yeah, this is going to take a while, guys. What's next? Okay. 
Okay, and then I gotta get a Makara Karn ready on Makoto. And then switch to a Persona with Counter. Yeah, rely on counter is not that reliable, that's for sure, unfortunately. Okay. Now I just gotta switch to a persona with counter and null um electric. And I think, um, right now I got, um, only the magical shield up, so hopefully I repel some damage. So yeah, this is going to take a while, guys. It's going to take a while. But we'll get there eventually. I'm ready. Okay. Please don't... Oh no, the fire affinity reverted. No! Crap! That was a waste of my car car in there. I wanted the Fire Break active, so that way I can repel damage, so that was a waste of SP. Ah. <coughs> okay, gotta revive Yukari and then use Cadenza with Makoto. Thanks for the dodge. And I just gotta use up everyone's SP so that way I can... I pretty much want to make sure that uh, Fuka uh, uses SP recovery and nothing else. How much longer are you gone streaming? I don't know. I don't know how long this is gonna take. Right now I can only rely on counter off of Makoto and that's it. Until uh, Fuka fully restores her theurgy. Oh yeah, and it's also possible for the characters to lose the theory, part of their theurgy when they get KO'd, which is why uh, Yukari doesn't have her theurgy maxed. Okay. Do you think it will get easier the further you get in the game when you unlock more personas? I'm pretty sure that goes without saying. Yes.
But we gotta rely on Fuka right now. And Fuka is slowly regenerating her Theurgy, but yeah. But yeah, this might be fruitless, but I don't care. As long as we're making some sort of progress, that's all that counts. Jeez, what do you have against uh, Mitsuru? Jeez. Yeah, it sucks we don't have healing skills with Mitsuru. Because her healing skills could really come in handy. I'm just hoping that uh, Makoto repels physical at some point. But right now I just gotta use up everyone's SP because that's what's gonna further trigger the chances of us restoring SP when we use Fuka's Theurgy. But yeah, part of me feels like maybe I should have waited until I get at least Invigorate just so I could reduce the amount of grinding I'm doing with this. But you know what? I just want to get at least one Guardian out of the way so we can make some sort of progress in Tartarus. Are we going to be completing all the social links or are you going to only focus on the challenge? Well, I'm only focusing on the challenge. I'm not focused on being a completionist. I wish they would just physically attack Makoto because that's really all I need is them to physically attack Makoto. But I just gotta wait for an eternity for Fuka's Theurgy, which should be very soon. Oh my god, really? I would help if I could. But yeah, once Junpei gets his counter skill, then this would be a lot easier. But yeah, Fuka's really taking forever, considering that I got the fortune thing. I did the fortune thing so I can increase the chances of it triggering faster.
But yeah, Fuka's really taking her precious time, seriously. Okay, she's just on the edge of getting her Theurgy. But yeah, this is gonna take forever, just my god. Come on, use Power Slash on me. Power Slash on me, nobody else. And I want to use everyone else's um, SP so that way I can increase the chances of uh, Fuka restored. Oh, I have Oracle. Okay, so I could use Oracle. I just need to have everyone's um, HP fully restored. Ah, oh, crap. All right, good. HP fully restored. Okay, Fuka, brain it on. Please don't be a heat riser. Good. Good. That's what we needed, Fuka. Thank you. Okay, there we go. So now let's get Fire Break at the ready. And then Makara Karn. <clears throat> Nyx is waiting for you right now, lol. Yeah, at this point she might as well, yeah. Karn. And I might have to use Fire Break again if I don't repel the magical back. Alright, Theurgy maxed. Okay, not the one that I wanted, but at least it's progress. Yeah, I make it slow progress. I probably should have waited until I got Invigorate 1 with Makoto and Counter with uh, Junpei. But you know what? I just want to make progress. If it takes me forever, so be it. I just want to make progress. Uh, let's see, um... I think I'm fine with one fire break for now, so let me just go to this guy for counter. And I'll use Theurgy just so everyone has an evasion and whatever up. Okay, my Makara card is already used up. Thought I didn't use it up. I guess I did. Crap. Um, okay. Uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Um, guard. Okay, I need a fire break. Them where it hurts. 
If you got tired, Demi-Feet is ready to cheer you up. Ha. Huh? Okay. Now I gotta get a Makar Karn at the ready. And I gotta start using up everyone's SP because I gotta wait for an eternity for Fuga to raise um, her Theurgy gauge. Okay, so I got Fire Break on, so I have one more Tetra or Makar Karn at use. Sukakaja, of course. Mm. What's the plan here? And of course I use it on the the Lightning Eagles because of course. Well, at least that's a little bit of damage dealt, but still. My god, this is going to take forever. But at least we have a way of restoring SP for once. Okay, so back to my null like persona with counter. 10% chance of repelling physical skills. Oh wait, hold on, no. There we go, equipped. <clears throat> Come on, counter. Counter, that was a physical skill, Makoto. You could have countered it. You know what, at this point, they're gonna run out of their SP by the time we get through this fight. Just hopefully the Eagles attack with physical and nothing else. But now I just gotta use up um, everyone's SP so that way I can increase the chances of Fuka using the SP recovery. Yeah, this is going to take forever, guys. I swear, if I die after hours of going into this, I'll just drive myself mad. Okay, so they can use Power Slash, so it's not like they can't... I just wonder how much SP they have, because if they have SP that can be wasted, then that could be beneficial. But yeah, but yeah, I think um, the party members actually recover their theurgy faster than Fuka does, honestly. If we waited almost 50 minutes or however much for the Emperor and Empress, we can also for this. Yeah. We pretty much had to use every single SP um, restorative item that we had just to get through that. That was ridiculous, but we did what we had to do. But yeah, I have no idea how long this is going to take me. Mm. 
All I know is that I gotta use up everyone's SP. But yeah, I'm just hoping that there's a rare chance that um, one of them will do a physical attack on Makoto and I can counter them. <coughs> Jeez. But yeah, I gotta use up Yukari's SP here. Okay, Fuke is slowly regenerating, but at least she's regenerating. Ah, come on, repel the damage, Makoto. I know 10% is low, but please repel. <laughs> Jeez. But yeah, I gotta seriously use up Yukari's SP. My god. Can you do a physical attack on Makoto already? Ah, come on, repel it. Yeah, I'm gonna be here forever, guys. Okay, how much... Okay, we're pretty close to getting um, Fuka's Theurgy here. So I'm gonna save Makoto's Theurgy until we get around to uh, Fuka's Theurgy. Nice dodge. So I gotta wait until Oracle is active. Come on, repel it. God. God, I wish Makoto would just repel the damn skill already. Patience is my middle name. Honestly, if this was a random battle, I would totally just stop, but because this is a Tartarus Guardian, stopping is, well, an option, but I don't want to stop if I can get through it. Because this is, because getting through this is required to make progress. Okay, still don't have Fuka's Theurgy yet. But yeah, I could be here for hours just to try to get through this fight. Oh, okay, we got Oracle now, so we're gonna use uh, Cadenza. And then make sure everyone is fully healed before we use Oracle.
Yeah, I gotta make sure everyone's fully healed because everyone took damage from that attack. Okay, <clears throat> let's see. Okay, one enemy goes, um, hold on. Okay, I'll use a cure water. Oh, come on! Okay. Gotta make sure everyone's fully healed. Okay, fully healed, so now's a good time to use Oracle. No! Fuka, no! Why'd you use the fucking Heat Riser? No! Fuka, you just fucked it up! Oh, Fuka, you just fucked it up. We're not even halfway through this fight and you just fucked it up, Fuka. You fucked it up. That's it. Fuka is no longer a part of our team, guys. So yeah, even if we're fully healed, we got to worry about her using the all-party heat riser. Fuka, priorities. SP recovery. Your leader is low on the SP. Use SP recovery. And I'm pretty sure I used Cadenza not too, too long ago, so we all had our agility up not too long ago. Aw, oh, Fuka, you just fricked it up. You know what? I'm actually thinking maybe I should try this fight another time. I know I spent so long on this fight, but I'm gonna spend even longer on this fight if I just keep going. Okay, I need to think here. Because even if I get Fuka's Theurgy all the way up, she could just use another Heat Riser on us again. I'm thinking maybe I should come back to this fight another time, honestly. You know, I'm just gonna guard until I die. I don't care anymore. Just guard till I die, because at this point I lost any point of caring. Ugh. You fricked it up, Vuka. You fricked it up. At this point, I might as well just die on purpose. This is probably going to take forever, but it is what it is. Maybe I could get a counter or two if I'm lucky. I think I should spend the time grinding instead. Spend the time grinding... Just spend the time grinding so that way I can uh, get at least the Hermit to Invigorate 1 and at least um, Junpei up a level so he can learn Counter. So that way I have another character with Counter. I think that's what I should do. Yeah, th this was this was fruitless. At least we were able to get somewhere, but it was still a fruitless battle. Okay, at this rate, my party is not gonna die if they are guarding, so I'm just gonna use. So I'm just gonna waste skills. Yeah, Polypa don't work. Surprise.
Come on, use counter. It exists for a reason, Makoto. I'm just gonna die on purpose. It's probably gonna take me forever to die on purpose, but whatever. We could definitely make progress in this fight, but I think I need to grind until I get in Big Rate 1 just so I don't have to rely on Fuka for SP recovery. Okay, let me switch to someone else. Uh, I'll go with, um... Uh, who can I go with? Um, I guess I'll go with, um... I'll just go with you, since you have counter and don't resist, um, electric. Okay, finally we're dying here. God, this sucks. I just gotta let Makoto die, that's all I care about. Fuka, you had one job, and that was to provide me with an SP recovery, and you fricked that up. But man, is this going to be fun to script. Alright, cool, I'm shocked. Man, it takes forever just to die on purpose. I guess it shows you just how safe I am in this fight. I'm very safe in this fight with the setup that I have. I just gotta get Naga up to learn Invigorate 1 and then transfer the skill to other personas. But yeah, this is gonna take forever. And mind you, I have a persona with counter, and it just shows just how unreliable it, it can be. Yeah, I've got hit with so many physical attacks, and so far counter has not triggered. Alright, the girls are dead, so now it's just killing Makoto. Makoto, die. My god. It just really shows you just how safe I am in this fight. But yeah, Fuka is taking forever just to get to her Theurgy, so yeah, relying on Fuka's Theurgy for SP recovery is really not a good strategy, unfortunately. I mean, it was useful, but it's not a good strategy to rely on her Theurgy.
No, I want to die on purpose, unfortunately. I just gotta wait to die on purpose. It just takes forever. Come on, inflict shock on Makoto. Wow. I don't know how long I spend on that fight, but it just shows you that I am actually prepared endurance-wise for that fight. It's just I need a more reliable SP recovery method, and grinding for soul drops is one method. But it seems like the most reliable method is to pretty much get the Invigorate 1 off of Naga. But that requires me pretty much using the entirety of this moon cycle to get, um... Let's retry battle! No, don't. I pretty much have to rank up the Hermit Social Link as much as possible. Try to get Invigorate 1 as soon as possible. And then use that Invigorate 1 to pretty much restore SP. Because that's going to be the most reliable method of SP recovery. Well, Fuka's Theurgy is a method for SP recovery. It's not going to be that reliable, unfortunately. Alright, I'll be right back, guys. I just need to quickly fill my water bottle. Okay, I'm back. Alright, so we're going to do a little bit of grinding in Tartarus now for at least this day. And then once we return back to reality, we just got to remember to get the medicine from the nurse's office. Because that's one of the requests that Elizabeth asked for. Are you accepting a request? <clears throat> so the fashionable item we can definitely get if we grind enough money. Otherwise, um, there, we're definitely not going to get the item to get the discount. We'll probably have to pay the full thing to pay for this. But then again... You do anything, but it'd be greatly appreciated. I don't know. Maybe, maybe getting this is not as important because the reward is not useful. But yeah, the chariot, uh, Mithras, we'll probably need at some point. But I don't know what level we need to be at to fuse Mithras. But I guess in the meantime, we can do the Shadow Hunted Milestone and try to get 300. But yeah, the medicine is the next thing that we'll definitely need to get pretty soon. So we'll definitely do this once we go back to school tomorrow. Very well, then. Okay, so anyways, uh, we're gonna save here. And we're going to do some grinding, and, uh, actually, hold on, before we do grinding, let me just check my stats. Okay, so I'll definitely want Yukari on my team, so that way she can level up at least a few more levels. Yeah, I'll level Yukari up at least. But, uh, my main goal is to get Junpei leveled up, so that way I can learn counter. I think once I learn counter with Junpei, then I'll finish my grinding here. So that's going to be the main goal, is to get Junpei's counter during this day. 
As for Akihiko, he's actually pretty close to leveling up to the next level, so I might get him leveled up at least before leaving. And as for Mitsuru, she requires a lot of EXP to level up, but, um, yeah. I mean, pretty much everyone needs leveling up. What am I talking about? Okay, so use the teleporter. Floor 21. So, right now our main goal is to get counter on Junpei. That's pretty much our main goal, is to get counter onto Junpei before we leave. And if we need to do SP recoveries, we just farm for either soul drops or rely on Fuka's, um, Theurgy. Do I want to rely on Sexy Dance, or should I rely on Mitsuru only? Yeah, you know what? Maybe I'll rely on Mitsuru only uh, for the job. Eh. Not really a good persona here to use. Yeah, I guess I'll just... Stick with him for now. Guard. And I'll just rely on Mitsuru for a charm from this point forward so I can uh, conserve Makoto's SP. Oh crap, I should have defensed up on um, Misuru. <coughs> Jeez. But here we go, the Marin Karen run that you've all been waiting for, guys. So yeah, I don't know how long the grind is going to be because, again, it's been over a month since I last um, played this challenge run. Go, Baron Karen! Hell yeah! So yeah, having... Mitsuru with Marin Karen is going to be helpful because then I can only use one Tetracarn with Makoto and this should speed up everything. There we go. And low enough that one Tetracarn is enough to defeat him. But yeah, Marin Karen does not miss, guys. Not anymore. Okay. Catch Karn. Now it's just a matter of getting it to attack Makoto physically. Alright, which uh, persona should we level up? Uh, doesn't matter, everyone's in the thousands. Yeah, yeah, it really doesn't matter. Hmm. 
Now I just gotta wait for this enemy to uncharm itself. Oh, okay. Didn't take long for it to do a physical attack on Makoto, and shit, I just realized this grinding is gonna be awful. How much did Junpei level up? Oh my god, this is gonna be a long grind, guys. God damn it. Okay, um, I think what I'm gonna do is uh, switch the rain off of Makoto, give him the... Uh, guard ban, and then I'm gonna have um, Junpei wear the rain, so that way he can gain his more EXP. And I think I might kick one of uh, my party members off the team or something. What will you do? Don't know who I'll kick off the team. Probably um, Yukari or something. I'll probably kick Yukari off the team. And unfortunately, I can't really do that until I get to an entrance. Which, thankfully, I can do from here. But yeah, I think I'll kick Yukari out of the team. I'll kick Yukari out of the team so that way I can gain more EXP gain for Junpei. Alright, so goodbye Yukari. And I'm gonna keep Mitsuru in so that way she can use Marin Karen. Or maybe I should just go in with just Junpei and Makoto. I don't know. Um. Ah, I hate this. <gasps> This is going to be an awful grind, guys. It's probably going to be another little while before we can actually get to another level. But we pretty much just wanted uh, Mitsuru with us so we can conserve the SP on Makoto with, uh, so that way we can use the right. Marin Karen and Charm. Okay, who goes first? Okay, the enemy that isn't inflicted goes first. Shoot! Darn it. Not what I wanted. Oh my god, really? So I need the enemy that goes second charmed first. And then charm the other one. Let's switch to something else. Okay, there we go. Frenzy's good. And then I just charm the other one. Charm the other one so that way one Tetracarn is enough for a defeat. Alright, good. So one Tetracarn should be enough for a defeat. There we go, so one Tetracarn should be enough for a defeat. So now I just gotta guard. I probably switch to a null win persona. Good plan. Now I just gotta wait for it to use a physical attack on Makoto.
This is going to be an awful grind, but it's as efficient as we're going to get. Oh my god, this is gonna take forever! I know we don't need that, but I if Mitsuru gets KO'd, then at least that's more chances of it attacking me. And I mainly want Junpei to level up. Okay, insufficient SP, okay. Okay, it's gonna do this insufficient SP bullshit. But at least that's increasing the chances of it doing a physical attack. Well, this is gonna take forever. <clears throat> oh yeah, I could also use Enrage, that's another thing. I could use Enrage, um... There we go, now it will attack physically. And now, if only it will attack uh, the person I want it to attack. Please attack Makoto. Oh my god, seriously? This run is awful, guys. This run is freaking awful. At this rate, I might as well just waste my SP trying to get the damn thing to attack me. About time. Oh, shuffle time. No rare cards, but at least I get a persona that I don't have. But I want to EXP up. Guys, I just realized how awful this grind's going to be. You know what, maybe at this point, maybe it's not worth it. Maybe it's not worth the grind, honestly. Ah, frick. I mean, who needed leveling up? It was mostly Yukari and um, Akihiko, right? I mean, Akihiko I don't really care much about. I don't know, maybe I should just worry about leveling up at least one of the characters and that's it. Or maybe I shouldn't bother leveling anyone up at all and instead just, um... You know, maybe instead of worrying about leveling anyone up, maybe I should just worry about getting the highest EXP bonus whatevers, um... And get that... and get Naga up to the highest possible level as soon as possible. I don't know. Maybe I'm just grinding for nothing. Okay, don't attack, just, um... I guess I'll use my Theurgy here. How'd you even die last time? What do you mean, last time? Okay, so I just gotta get the uh, this thing down to its lowest health before I have it attack the enemy. You it. 
Because I want one Tetracarn to be enough to defeat it. Alright, good dodge, good dodge there, or good uh, block there, I mean. I think this will be a good time to use um, Baron Karen on the other guy here. There we go. Tetrakarn. All right, now I just got to wait for an eternity here. All right, good. Yeah, the grinding is honestly not worth it. My god, we gained so little EXP, it's not even worth it. I mean, I guess we just gotta do a few dozen battles and we can get somewhere at least, but still. I think I'll just grind until I'm out of SP and then I'll probably head back or something. Charm. Uh, I'm already suffering from this run, I can assure you that. <clears throat> Speaking of reload, are you excited for episode I guess? Yeah, it looks pretty good. Looks like it's going to be pretty good. Of course she relies on the Heat Riser. But yeah, I never thought I'd be so... so... <coughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <coughs> never thought I'd be so excited to learn Mary Karen. Or get Mitsuru for Mary Karen. Ugh, jeez. <coughs> Alright, so far so goodish. <clears throat> okay, how low was his HP? 
Okay, that's not so bad. So I can use Tetracorn here. But yeah, this run is awful. There's no way to just describe it. This run is freaking awful. Oh wait, it's already Marin Karen. What am I doing? I'm an idiot. You hate this song? You don't mean that. Come on. This is the best song that has ever existed. Deceased. Shuffle time. And of course I don't get anything useful. Why? It'd be useful if I got some useful game. And that's a like a fool card would probably make me consider grinding here longer. So I got a little bit of SP left on Makoto. Think you'll finish this run before SMT5 um, V comes out? I have no idea. <clears throat> no freaking idea. Oh crap, these are the bad guys. These guys are not good. I gotta escape. These guys are more problematic than they're worth. But yeah, I think what I need to do is pretty much um, not just grind for soul drops. Okay, should I even open up this chest? I probably shouldn't because this is like the first half of Arqua. And I should have access to the second half of Arqua. And I haven't even beaten the first goddamn Tartarus Guardian of Arqua. Ah, god, this run is awful. Ah. That teleporter can take us to the end. How much how much SP do I have on Makoto? Okay, I only have enough for one Tetra card. Maybe two if I use a soul drop. Okay. Yeah, that's probably not worth it. Okay, I'm getting some soul drops from these things. That's good. More soul drops, the better. Oh my god, I'm getting a lot of good soul drops from this. This is great. Yeah, definitely not getting anywhere with this. Well, out of curiosity, maybe I could do something with it, but I highly doubt it. Oh, 
Oh, shit. And I'm pretty sure it's gonna recover instantly after this. Yeah, this ain't worth it. Yeah, even if I set up Tetra Card, it's not gonna get us anywhere. This was a waste of time. Yeah. We just don't have enough turns to be able to take it down. That's the problem. <sighs> Let's continue exploring. Yeah, honestly, I think I should just quit the grinding and just continue bonding with the hermit in the real world every single chance I can possibly get. There's a shadow. <clears throat> and depending on how many days are left, I can pretty much use those remaining days to grind Naga up to the point that I can get Invigorate 1. A part of me just hopes that I can get Invigorate 1 as soon as possible without having to grind out, or without having to max out the Hermit. I just wish that's the case, but... God, there's, there's just so many inconveniences with, the, with, um, with this run. It's like every time I come up with a good strategy, I just realized just how awful the grind is gonna be. There's a shadow. Careful, the enemy's nearby. All right, let's continue exploring. Uh, yeah, invigorate skills do stack, but it's not gonna matter if I can't get any. I do have a chance of being able to get Invigorate 1 if I do a lot of grinding with Naga, but the most efficient way of being able to get it sooner is to get the Hermit up to the highest possible rank before I could even get it. So I just gotta remember to get the medicine from uh, the nurse's office when I return back because that's part of the reason why I am doing the grinding now so I can get the medicine uh, to complete that one request. I did a bit of grinding, but I think that's all I'm going to do. It's just not worth it, honestly. It's just not worth all the grinding that I got to do just to get anywhere. Good day. Are you accepting a request? Eh, I still got to hunt more shadows to get this reward, which is not worth it. Eh, I got to fuse a lot of personas for that. Still not worth it. The fashionable item... I could probably get if I get enough money for it. Steel pipe, this I can literally get tomorrow. I just gotta remember to go to the nurse's office. Very well. So I think that's all the grinding I'm gonna do for now, unfortunately. So I'm gonna head back. At least I got some EXP and some extra items on me, so it wasn't a complete waste. And of course, it gave me the ability to get the medicine as soon as possible. Okay, Kenai. Faculty office, or faculty hallway. Go to the nurse's office, and I just gotta pick up the medicine. Hi, Mitsuru, how you doing? See you. <coughs> Jeez. Okay, got the medicine, cool. So now I can complete that request. And, uh, what else was I doing? Um, 
Oh yeah, I can't get the fashionable object right now, but here we go. Good day. Can't you get the Invigorate skill card? I would if I can get it. Are you accepting a Wonderful. Okay, so here we go, the medicine. Steel pipe. And nothing new. I guess I could see if I could do this, but that's a waste of money, honestly. <clears throat> the world you live in is so in the meantime, my main uh, social links to bond with would be Chariot and Hermit at the moment. Alright. Well. So I'm just going to sell the materials that I got. Oh, and it's also a sale. So yeah, I don't have a um, hundred and fifty to buy the thing from the shop, but it doesn't really matter. I'm not really missing out on much if I avoid it. Prices are a bit lower today. Take a look if you have the chance. Okay, everyone has the best um, armor. So what about footwear? Uh, let's see. Suru. That what you want? All right, then. Okay, there we go. So Mitsuru definitely has better evasion now. And I think that's pretty much it. Okay, Iron Edge, which gives um, an Endurance 1. Uh, steel Pipe, I can sell that. Power bands I can completely sell. You <clears> finished? Be seeing you. All right, there we go. Now, who do I bond with for now? Uh, definitely focus on my school social link. So, Herbert should be my priority. Or, I mean, Chariot should be my priority. I mean, yeah, Hermit should be my priority, but she's only available on the Sundays. So I'm going to go to the uh, classroom. I'm going to prioritize the Chariot. Because there's an entire request centered around that. And I do have a Chariot persona on me, right? Yes, I do. Okay. So right now, I'm just going to use um, the majority of the time to raise the rank with the Hermit as much as possible within the deadline I have left. That's pretty much the main goal. Just raise it with the Hermit. Hold on. Oh wait, I know what the exclamation mark is for. It's for a club escapade, right? Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure I don't even have what I need. Yeah, honestly, it's probably not a big deal if I miss out on this stuff. I mean, I kind of want to prioritize getting this star necklace, if anything, to block all ailments. That'd probably be the next best thing to get. <clears throat> But one thing I can do... <coughs> oh, jeez. <coughs> I could spend time here and work a part-time job to raise my charm and courage while getting some money. At least until I can bond with the Hermit.
So hopefully there's nothing on Sundays that uh, takes away my time bonding with the Hermit, because the more time that I have away from the Hermit, the more time I have to grind. Actually, let me check my calendar. Uh, when's the next full moon? Okay, so I have one, two... Three possible days that I can bond with the Hermit. And then at least uh, two nights of Tartarus before the next full moon. So I have three extra days to bond with the Hermit. And the Hermit is at level 7, I think? Okay, so 8, 9, 10. So if I don't need to deepen my bond with the Hermit, then I might be able to max her out. But at most, I might be able to get at least up to rank 9 with her. So as long as I don't need to deepen my bond with her, then I might be able to get at least up to rank 9. Rank 10 if I'm lucky. All right, then. But yeah, right now, bonding with Miyamoto is going to be the most important thing right now, so... Okay, hold on. I gotta change uh, social links here. Miyamoto. And shoot, what rank am I even at? Watch your knee, uh, tougher. Okay, so I'm going from 8 to 9, right? 8 to 9. Okay, so you get no points if you say no, not exactly. One point if you say it's fine, I'm tough as hell. But you gain 3 if you say I don't mind at all. Oh, and next rank I'll be able to max him out, so that'll be great. So he might be my first social link to max out. Oh, sweet. This is actually going to be another useful benefit, is being able to uh, bond with uh, certain um, links and uh, be able to... and be able to improve their capabilities, essentially. Although, which ones are going to be useful really does depend. I did a quick research on it, but I think Yukari will be useful because it's less SP cost for, um, for, uh, healing. So wait, if a boss is impossible, are you just gonna bypass it? If I have to turn it into a minimalist rod, then I will need to. I just gotta prove that, um... I'm incapable of attacking, essentially. <clears throat> but yeah, so I can actually start bonding with my, um... With my party members to essentially deepen my bonds further with them. So first, let's just go to the rooftop. I can't do anything above that yet. And, okay, I can actually start bonding with everyone, but yeah, Yukari will definitely be the most important. I'm pretty sure Mitsuru increases the critical chances uh, against enemies afflicted with ailments. Which, unfortunately, is not going to be useful for us. Ah, man. I don't have anything to chill with. Darn it. Okay, let me just go to the roof. Harvest. What can I plant? Uh, I guess this is the, the best I can plant right now. <clears throat> no. Oh my god, stop it. Okay. Lounge. There we go. But yeah, if I remember correctly, she only increases the chances of you landing a critical 
if an enemy is afflicted with an ailment, which unfortunately is useless for us. Uh, Fuka, I forget what her what her additional perk was, but yeah, you essentially need to spend time with them three times. Okay. But yeah, Junpei I think will be useless because he just we, we just increase his critical chances, I think. So yeah, Yukari is right now the only useful one for us. So we're going to bond with Yukari. And this increases my charm, so this is a good time to pass time. Hey, yup. Okay, so Fuka reduces the damage from weaknesses. Okay, so that can be useful. That can be useful. But it's definitely not going to help us get through the run as efficiently as possible. But decreasing the SP costs when using um, Yukari's healing is definitely going to be useful. Okay, C. Yeah, so Junpei is crit boost, which is not going to be useful. Mitsuru increases the chances of us landing a critical. Oh, we got the art club thing available. So I guess we could do the art club thing. That'll be the next thing we can do. <clears throat> Let's see. So this will start us another uh, social link. All right, fortune, good. Alright, so who's available? Akihiko. What is Akihiko's um, additional ability? Um, what, what was his additional ability? Because if he's useful, then I definitely want to bond with Akihiko if possible. Hold on. I'll look it up. <laughs> Okay, so it was characteristics, right? Alright, so, um... Okay, so with Yukari, it's healing, so reduces the SP cost of healing skills by 50%, and then reduces the SP cost of healing skills by 25%, so essentially you just reduce the SP cost with Yukari. Uh, Junpei is all about critical boost, which is useless. Uh, Aegis is all about strengthening physical skills, um, which is useless. Uh, Mitsuru is about increasing the critical rate on foes with ailments, which is not going to be useful because we can't attack them. Okay, so Akihiko increases the effects of buffs on self and greatly increases the effects of buffs on self. That might be useful in a situational setting. I don't know. That might be useful, depending. But yeah, Fuka reduces uh, damage taken when... And allies weakness is struck, so she will be useful. And Shinjiro would technically be useful, but you know. And then Ken automatically recover five SP each turn in battle. That will be incredibly useful when we get to him. And then Koromaru lowers the accuracy and evasion of one foe or all foes for three turns when a battle starts. That might be useful, but very situational. So I think out of all of them, Yukari would definitely be the most useful. And everyone else seems to be very situational. <clears throat> so 
So yeah, it might be useful doing buffs on himself, but I don't know. But if it's on himself and I'm not going to use um, him as much, then he may not be as useful. I don't know. It, it's a very situational thing because he's not really the party member that I'm planning to use for the entire run. And since it's a Wednesday, I... Since it's a Wednesday, I can just pass time at uh, Chagall Cafe just to raise my charm and courage. So I'm just going to do this instead. Part time. Alright, charm level 4 so I can... Uh, start a rank with the devil social link eventually. Whenever he's available. But yeah, Ken is going to be so OP for this run. And apparently, um... Apparently Elizabeth wants me for something. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Oh yeah, missing persons. I hate this mechanic because it wastes uh, a nighttime slot if you don't know when the last person will be lost in there for. So as long as we rescue them before that deadline, then it's not going to be a big deal. So yeah, when is the last possible person before the deadline, um... Or how many people get lost during this moon cycle? Like, how many people get lost into Tartars during this moon cycle? And actually, there might be a chance we may not even be able to save them. We may not be able to save them because we can't get high enough in Tartarus to get anywhere, so... We might actually have people die in this run. So yeah, a pacifist run ironically leads to people dying, guys. <laughs> wow. I just realized just how awful this run truly is. Okay, who's available at school? Um, okay, so... I'm gonna just max out Miyamoto right now because, um... Because uh, there's an entire, um... So I'm just gonna max him out. So there's three? Alright. Yeah, I'm pretty sure what you say here doesn't matter. Yeah, what, what you say here doesn't really matter, so okay, let's hear it. It doesn't matter what you say because you're gonna max them out right, right around here. So what about your big meat? You got this. And there we go, we've maxed out our first social link of this run, the Chariot. Woo! So now we should be able to complete that request that Elizabeth has for us, um, efficiently when we eventually fuse Mithras, how, whatever level we need to be at to fuse it. And we could fuse Thor, awesome. Alright, so that's one social link maxed. Alright. Honestly, I never actually did finish Portable. I really only bought Portable on Steam at a discount. Mostly just so I can do the female route. Mostly so I can see what the female route is like. That was pretty much the only reason I got it. Okay, Fuka is available. So I guess I'll bond with Fuka because lowering the chances of us getting our weaknesses hit is definitely useful. Raise my academic, so yep, I'll do that.
All right, so two more with Fuka, and then we can decrease the amount of damage that we get from having our weakness hit. Okay, so I'll get two other lost persons, good to know, but I may not even be able to save any of them. I may not be able to save any of them if I can't beat the Tartarus Guardians that block them. Okay, so who can we spend time with here? Okay, so Miyamoto is maxed out, so we got Kenji, we got um, the Emperor guy, we got Fuka as a possible... Actually, I think we need, um, I think we need a, a certain rank to bond with Fuka, though. But yeah, Junpei we're not gonna bother with, um, because he doesn't provide any useful benefit for us. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure we can't bond with Fuka, but let me just go talk to Fuka anyway. Uh, I think I actually need max courage. Yeah, I think you need max courage to bond with Fuka. So it's gonna be a while before we can even bond with her. Uh, let me see. Um, who's available? Um, I guess I could do the Emperor, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I guess I'll do the Emperor. Oh, jeez. Again, I'm recovering from being recently sick. Okay, so... Do I gotta kiss this guy's ass again? Let me see. Okay. No need to fight or what happened. Okay, you both get one point regardless of what you say. So yeah, max stat for the girls, because yeah, I think you need max charm to bond with Yukari, max academics to bond with Mitsuru, and max um, courage to bond with Fuka, essentially. That sucks, honestly. Oh no, I'm pretty much already better. I mean, I had strep throat, that's what I was sick with, but um, I am definitely better than I was. Okay, we got Yukari available. So yeah, I'll bond with Yukari. Uh, I guess bird. Okay, and then tomorrow's a Sunday, which means more SP drinks to pick up. And I gotta make sure that I bond with the hermit and give the best responses. I gotta get the hermit at the highest possible level before the next full moon. Oh, wait. It's not a true run unless you pet Koromaru. If you don't pet Koromaru, then you fail as a Persona Challenge Runner. Sure. Go on, Koro-chan. You know how to say hi, right? Seen him sitting by the steps of the shrine. All right, so there we go. I have completely justified this run by petting the dog. If I don't pet Koromaru, this run is invalid.
All right. Okay, so who's available here? Uh, Junpei or Akihiko? Akihiko might be useful. Maybe. Hmm. I don't know. Or I could alternatively bond with the man in the suit. I don't know. Who should I who should I spend time with? What do you give me? Courage. Yeah, Junpei's not gonna be useful. I don't know who to bond with. I don't know. I guess I'll spend time with, um, with what's his face, um, this guy. Oh, that's going to use up all my yen. Is this even worth it? You know what? Maybe this is not worth it. Maybe I'll bomb with him a little later when I have more yen in my pocket. Eh, I don't know what I should uh, prioritize. You know what, just for the heck of it, I'll just bomb with Akihiko. Maybe his passive perk might be useful later down the road. Uh, you pet Koromaru for 10 minutes straight? Good. Okay, home shopping program. And I gotta make sure I bond with the Hermit. Okay. A new protective suit, so I'll definitely buy it. And definitely a good reason why I didn't spend all that money on Tanaka while I was um, at the mall. Instead, spend it at a cheaper price while you're watching his shopping program. Thanks. Okay, do I have a Hermit Persona on me? Yes, I do. Okay. I uh, just gotta... Brain out my cheat sheet so I can bond with her efficiently. Hold on. Darn it. Phone, stop messing up. Okay. Hurry up and tell me. What is he like? Okay, rank 8. So hopefully I can get to max rank before the full moon. If not, at least 9 rank should be good enough for me to at least get somewhere. Alright, let's see. Who's available? No one's available, okay. Well, alrighty then. Um, and the monk's available, so I guess I'll deepen my- I guess I'll start a social link with a monk or something. I'll probably start a social link with the monk. Okay, now I just got to order some alcohol and I got to remember what every single damn person has ordered. Crap. <clears throat> okay, so upbeat man. Maybe I should write it down just in case. Hold on. 
Okay, so... Upbeat man wants... Hold on. Okay, an oolong tea. Okay, so he wants the oolong tea. I'm just gonna write it down because I don't want to spend time memorizing everything. So, unemotional woman. Hold on. Unemotional mo woman so she wants the margarita hold on margarita I just don't feel like memorizing everything here okay so the temperamental woman Okay, Bloody Mary. Be sure to say that uh, three times in the mirrors, guys. Okay, so she wants a Bloody Mary. I'm pretty sure it's only four people, right? Okay, and then Active Woman. Okay, so screwdriver is what she wanted. Okay, now I'm pretty sure it was just three, or just four, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just four. <clears throat> Alright. Sure did. The girl by the entrance, she wanted, um... Okay, she was the unemotional woman, so she wanted the margarita. Okay, and then the temperance woman, she wanted Bloody Mary. Okay, and then the active woman, she wanted the screwdriver. And the upbeat man wanted the tea. And there we go, so now we can start a social link with, um, the monk. Probably won't spend a lot of time with him, but at least we have a social link unlocked. More Twilight Fragments from Elizabeth, the better. Or just Google it? What do you mean, Google it? I'm pretty sure the orders are different every playthrough. Okay, let's see. C. I'm increasing my charm. <clears throat> All right, who's available? Uh, okay, Fuka. So it seems like only the um, Emperor is available. So I guess I'm bonding with him. Just gotta... Emperor Social Link. Oh, shoot! I gotta remember to do the vending machine drinks. I gotta remember to do the vending machine drinks. Okay, let me see here. So what rank was I at? Uh, rank uh, 3 to 4. Okay, so what you say doesn't matter here. The guy's gonna get punched anyway. Looks like you're hard at work. <clears throat> oh, 
All right, before I bond with anyone, uh, I just need to get my SP drinks. Okay. So who's available? Um, Junpei and Mitsuru, both useless. Okay, so now I just gotta go get my SP drinks. And I got another subscriber. Awesome. Keep them subscribing coming. I'm pretty sure there's nothing in here, but let me just see. <clears throat> yeah, nothing. But actually, let me just check Club Escapade for a second. Just... Okay. I might actually read that. Maybe get myself some of the thing that I can chill in the fridge. I think I might do that. Just get that, get the teriyaki or whatever it is that I buy that I can chill in the fridge just for the extra bonus stuff. Oh, I've already used it? Okay, so I just gotta buy it from the school. Okay. Okay. Never mind. I could have actually bought that a long time ago now, realizing it. Oh well. How we doing? Well, we're actually making progress doing the bonding process, and I've um, completely maxed out the chariot social link. So I'm going to work part-time here so I can gain some money as well as some social stats. Woo! Now I can, um, what do I do at rank 4 courage? I forget. Oh yeah, this is where we meet Strega for the first time. At least not the team, but us meeting Strega. Man, for a game about students going to high school, there's people that get shot with guns in these games. These games are violent, guys. What'd you eat? What do you mean? What did I eat? Oh, you're talking. Uh, you're talking about the other guy who ate lunch. Okay. Junpei, I don't care about you, Junpei. Eh, who should I bond with? Do I even have a Justice Persona on me? No, I don't, so either I do Magician or Emperor. I guess I'll do Emperor. Just do Emperor since I have the page open on my computer. Oh, wait, no, he's not available. Never mind. Uh, who's available? Okay, Kenji. Oh, okay, the Fortune uh, social link. So, yeah, I'll do Kenji since I don't have Fortune or... Or, um, I don't have fortune or justice on me at the moment. I know Junpei is available, but I'm gonna purposely ignore him. Alright, Kenji. Oh my god, the teacher he has a crush on is actually engaged! Let's point at him and laugh! Ha 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 ha
You just realize that your teacher is not in love with you. Ha 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 ha. Everyone point at him and laugh. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Okay, so the response that you want to actually say is let me handle this. Rank 9. Alright, Akihiko is too busy, um... Playing with his friend or whatever he's doing. Alright, got myself a new suit, so time to see if this suit is worth it. <clears throat> okay, and it looks like Yukari's available, so I'm definitely gonna spend time with her. But let me just check out the new suit here. Okay, an extra 30 HP. That's actually very good, so I'm gonna wear that. Okay. Okay, so who's available? Alright, so I'm gonna do Yukari. Less SP that I have to use on Yukari, the better. What is the question? Uh, oh yeah, backstabbing. I don't know. I guess it depends on the person, honestly. Like, how severe the backstabbing is or whatever. I mean, I would love to forgive and forget, for sure, but it depends on how severe the backstabbing is. Alright, so who's available? Okay, Yuko and, um... Emperor's available. I'm gonna bond with Emperor. One second, guys. I'm trying to get my cheat sheet out. Okay, once again, I have to kiss his ass. So right now, he's just pulling down his pants, turning around, butt cheek wide out. He didn't wipe or use the little water sprayer thing. He has um, fecal matter on his butt right now, and I gotta kiss his ass and say that they are the worst. Realistically, I would say you shouldn't accuse everyone, but I gotta kiss his goddamn ass, his fecal-filled ass, and say that they're the worst. God, this is awful. You can forgive and forget up to a certain point, in my opinion. Yeah. I mean, if you can forgive someone, forgiveness is always better than not forgiveness, but... It really depends on the severity, honestly. It depends on the severity. Okay, it's a Wednesday, which means I can work at Chagall Cafe, so I'm gonna do that. Instead of bonding with Akihiko. Part-time.
This sentence honored by Nitsa will forever haunt my mind until it utterly traumatized me. Well, blame Atlas. Okay, so the flutter effect. Blame Atlas. Blame Atlas for forcing us to kiss someone's ass. Okay, so who's available? Kenji and the other two that we don't have a persona for. So I guess we'll finish off Kenji's social link. Again, it's not a priority for me to max out every single social link. So it really doesn't matter if I'm wasting time with whoever. Okay, I don't have the cheat sheet out, but it doesn't matter. <coughs> We're a great friends, man. We got the handmade choker, cool. So there we go. We maxed out magician and chariot. So there we go, that's two social links completely maxed. Oh, it's you. Alright, who's available? Uh, Fuka. Yeah, I'll bond with Fuka. I'm guessing she's on the second floor. I don't think it really matters what you say during these conversations, honestly. Okay, so I just gotta read with Fuka one more time, so that way I can gain her passive um, characteristic trait to reduce the damage we take from having our weaknesses exploited. Alright, so she's calling me more about humans that we're gonna leave to die, unfortunately. Okay, so who's available now? Okay, we can do the Emperor, so we're going to continue bonding with the Emperor until we have someone else that's available. Alright, sorry. Um... Alright, so let's see, what do I need to respond? Um, doesn't matter what you say here. But I just got here. Yay, a rank that we didn't have to kiss his ass this time. Awesome, thank you game. Oh, cool. Harvest, and um, I can uh, spend time with uh, Yukari here, but first let me just go to the rooftop. Actually, what do the tomatoes do out of curiosity? I forget what the tomatoes do. Where's the tomatoes? Um... Okay, restores HP. Maybe I should head uh, to the flower shop and see what else I can buy because I'm not sure if uh, if the the SP recovery um, fru foods are available or not. I should probably do that at least uh, see if there's um, a better fruit available that I can plant. Oh, and I keep forgetting about the damn thing that I can chill. Okay, the thirtieth. Yeah, I need to remember to get that from my school. So get that and get something that I can, um, that I can plant on the roof.
All right. So I just got to remember to get uh, the planting and whatever, and then just get the um, uh, the teriyaki that is downstairs. I got to remember to get that. Okay, main lobby. And then the 30th is when we can store it. Yeah, the lukewarm teriyaki, okay. And I'll buy five of these ahead of time. Okay, and before we go back, let me just... Um, Okay, I'm pretty sure I did, but did I get the SP recovery drinks during this week? Yes, I did. Okay. Now, I just want to go to Port Island Station. Go to the flower shop and see if I can get the um, stuff that gives me the SP recovery. Uh, no, unfortunately not. I mean, there's the stuff that cures ailments, which will probably be useful. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll get this for now. I'll get that sprout for now until I can get the SP recovery. And I'm pretty sure there's no SP recovery drinks from these vending machines, right? Yeah. Okay, who's available? Do I have a strength or a justice on me? I know I don't have a justice. I don't have a strength. Okay, back to the velvet room. Nice. Okay, so... I just need to fuse a justice or a strength. One or the other. And Mithras whenever possible. Okay, can I ask you out? No, I can't, of course. Very well. Okay, let me just save here before I jump in. So I just need to fuse a strength or a justice. Are you in search of which will you choose? I'll definitely still need to keep the hermit on me. Okay, let's see here. Um, fusion what search. Kind of persona do you desire? There's only two I could fuse, and they're both devil. Ah, god darn it. This persona is powerful. Eh, whatever. G get at least uh, some of them out of the way. Okay, let's see here. Fire break. Rage boost. Provoke. And counter. Whatever, at least I get a new persona. And at least I get a devil persona for when I eventually bomb with Tanaka. And literally every single persona I can fuse is too high of a level. So I guess I'm summoning a persona. Okay, so justice. Please take a look. This persona, yes. And what was the other one? Strength. This persona, yes. Please take a look. I guess I'll bomb with strength just because I got more useful skills on this guy. So you'll be summoning this new inner strength. Very I'll just bomb with strength more right now.
All right, hallway. Okay, now I just gotta see what Yuko wants, or what the best response is for her Link is. Crap, I didn't see what, um, what rank A was at with her. Can I see? Hold on. Uh, it doesn't tell me what rank I was at with her. Shoot. Okay, here we go. So rank 5 to 6 is where I'm at. Okay, so it doesn't matter what you say here, you'll get one point regardless. As long as we believe in them. Props to Nitsa for kissing the radioactive hazard and surviving. Unfortunately, yeah. <laughs> Welcome back. Okay, so I can bond with the hermit tomorrow, so that's good to know. Okay, man in the suit, I'm not gonna bother bonding with. I guess I'll pass time with Akihiko. Hey. I mean, I don't know if his passive trait is gonna be useful, but... I'll at least get it ahead of time while I'm at it. But yeah, I'm just gonna keep on bonding until I eventually get to the highest possible rank I can get with um, the Hermit. Okay. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's the exact sprout that I got um, from the... Not bad, kid. Yeah, I'm not gonna get that. Thank you, Tanaka, but no thank you. Oh yeah, I need to go to the roof and plant those vegetables. I didn't do that. Hold on. Still need to do that. No. Oh my god, which, which button is it? Okay, here we go. Rooftop, I still need to plant those vegetables. Okay, there we go. So the sprout, so that way I can recover ailments, or recover from ailments. Uh, what am I doing here? Um, Alright, I was gonna... No. Okay, second floor hallway, gotta get some SP drinks. Just got to get it at the uh, EY Todai Station and Strip Mall. And then bond more with the Hermit, who looks like can rank up, so we should be able to get to rank 9 very, very soon here. There we go. Now Strip Mall. Ah, darn it. Wrong floor. Whatever. Go. Okay. Actually, I'm pretty sure the fastest way is to do this. Alright, so now I just gotta change my cheat sheet here. Hold on. Hermit, Social Link, Persona 3 Reload. Okay, and this is going from 8 to 9, right? <clears throat> okay, so you want to say... No way!
Okay, it seems like there's no answer for this, so... It doesn't matter what you say, it doesn't increase uh, your rank here. And then you want to say, what are you planning? Okay, so either I could deepen my bond with her uh, when I, uh, I mean, I guess maybe during the Saturday I could probably deepen my bond with her at the shrine so I could guarantee a 10th rank, but I don't know if I can, but I'll see. I guess it depends on whether or not if I could deepen my bond with her or not. All right. So anyway, who's available? No one's available. The monk's available, but yeah. What do I want to do? Nah, I guess I'll pass time at Iwato and I. Yeah. What do I want to raise? Um, I guess my academics would probably be the most important. So yeah, guys, if you want to skip studying but be smart, just go to a restaurant and eat food. So I should be able to increase my rank with, uh, what's-her-name once, hopefully. Dowsing. Alright, and I can bond with the Emperor. <clears throat> so that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, and I can use the fridge uh, on the next day, so I gotta remember to do that. Emperor social link. Uh, let me just get my cheat sheet out. Okay, it seems too harsh. Honestly, I'm ranking these guys up better than I did in my initial playthrough. But honestly, in my initial playthrough, I'm prioritizing, like, the, um, social linked episodes over my social links. And then gonna prioritize my social links on New Game Plus. If I ever get around to that, honestly. Okay, who's available? Mitsuru and... yeah, okay. Part-time job it is. Who's available? Junpei is available, but who the frick cares about him? Alright, and of course the ones that are available happens to be the Justice and Fortune. God damn it, guys. Alright, Velvet Room it is. Approaching the deadline sooner than I expected. 
So I need to get myself a Justice or a um, Fortune Persona. Personas you would like to fuse. Okay. It is a special persona you desire, is it not? I could get myself one right now if I can fuse unicorn, or if I had unicorn. Well then, shall we take a look? This would be a wise choice. Eh. I mean, I guess I could do this fusion and. This will at least uh, clear up a spot for me. What do you wish to inherit? I guess it's the best I can do. So counter, fire break, uh, what do I want? Uh, rage boost is not gonna do me anything, so I guess growth one, Eh, I guess Marin Karen. It seems you have been blessed. Well then, shall we begin? Okay, and now I just gotta. How are we doing right now? You might uh, see the ending first in this challenge run, then your first playthrough. I don't know. I'm just too lazy to play the game, honestly. No, I'm not too lazy to play the game. I just don't have time to. Oh, I can totally max out Captain Kid if I want to, but I'm not going to because I need the Hermit on me. Registering personas. Okay, so this is just a slight better fusion, so I guess I'll register. It's literally the exact same skills, except he learns a skill. Okay, so I want to look at, um, what was it, um, Justice and, um, uh, what was it, Justice and Fortune, right? Does that persona catch your eye? <coughs> Okay, so I have two Justice Personas, and do I have any Fortune? No Fortune Personas, and the ones that I can fuse, or the one that I can fuse, I need Unicorn. So I guess it's Justice it is. Persona, yes. Please take a look. Uh, yep. Persona. Definitely so this guy. This All right, Justice, I'm coming for ya. I'm just getting my cheat sheet ready. All right, let's see. Okay, so you want to say, don't worry about it. All right, so don't say the bottom ones. You want to say manga or classics. I'm having fun. And it doesn't matter what you say here. And it doesn't matter what you say there either. Oh, and when you get to a certain rank, be sure to kiss her. Because that will not lead to any consequences whatsoever. And sweet, looks like I can get a new skill with Yukari. I don't care if anyone else is available. Yeah, no one's available. Just get Yukari so that way I can decrease the SP cost. Alright, 
So watching might improve my charm, and Yukari might gain a new ability soon. Let's do this. There we go. So, new personality. So, our characteristics, heal and master. So, reduces the SP cost of recovery skills by 50% of their normal SP cost. So, this will definitely be very helpful since she's going to be the most reliable healer in this run. So, awesome. So, the next useful one will be Fuka. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, what time was it? Did I miss out on uh, putting the teriyaki into the fridge? Yes, I did. Okay, at least I missed it by one day, so I just gotta reverse it back to the 30th. Hold on. This isn't a big deal. They got the rewind feature as a thing. They got the rewind feature as a thing. Yeah, I should have done the fridge. So I'll just rewind it back to the evening and then put the teriyaki in the fridge. Then bond with Yukari. Thank god this rewind feature exists. Okay, so there we go. I can just rewind it back to the evening. Okay, put the teriyaki in the fridge. And then I can come back for it later, and now bond with Yukari. Yes. There we go. So yeah, she may never run out of SP during this entire run. <laughs> but at least it's less um, of a worry to uh, restore her SP. So, we just need to make sure that we can get the Hermit up a rank, and that's pretty much all we need to prioritize. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, it looks like I'm bonded with the Emperor today. Okay, Emperor Social Link. Just making sure I have my cheat sheet out. Uh, hold on. I just need to find where I need to rank him up. Okay, it was like 7 to 8, right? So... So you heard all that. It wasn't me is apparently the best response. Honestly, you, you would think that this would be the best response, but apparently it wasn't me would be the best response. Man, Japanese culture, you suck. Have more authentic responses. Yeah, I might actually be able to max out all my social links, honestly. Alright, Teriyaki, here I come. Alright, chill Teriyaki. Awesome. So, restores 100 HP to one ally, though I'm gonna keep it on me because I'm pretty sure this is a request from Elizabeth if I deliver this to Elizabeth at some point. Akihiko. Okay, uh, I think I'll pass time doing part-time jobs. 
And I'm pretty sure I already checked, but I just want to check um, the request just in case. I'm looking. Okay. Here are my okay. Requests. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna skip out on this. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna skip out on this because, I mean, power incense. It's not gonna be useful. So I think I'm gonna miss out on this uh, on this request. Nope. Yeah, nothing useful. Very well. All right, part-time job. Here I come. Why are the nameless NPCs badly textured? I don't know. I've done updates on this game, and that's never been fixed. And I know I'm not the only one with that problem. But I guess you could say that's all the um, magic mirrors and attack mirrors that they dumped on themselves that I cannot use. Alright, who's available? Okay, it looks like Justice is available, so I'm bonding with her. Alright. Justice, how you doing? They have no shame. I agree. Well, I mean, I'm skipping all the dialogue because this is going to be a long enough run anyways with the amount of stuff I got to do. Uh, well, how should I pass time here? I don't- I can't do a tower. I can't get a tower persona to bond with the monk. Eh. Crap. I'm going to prioritize raising my academics. All right, who's available? Junpei is available, but screw Junpei. It looks like the Emperor it is. Yep, Emperor it is. Okay, Amber Social Link. Okay. What matters is you realized it. Yeah, about time we're not kissing his ass. Okay, and it looks like the next rank, we don't have to use this cheat sheet anymore. Awesome. Less ass kissing, the better, please. Okay, you 
Kari's available. And this will be my third time uh, making something with her. And she'll gain a new ability soon. Awesome! We've pretty much maxed out her characteristic pretty much right away. And there we go. I think this is literally the best thing we can get, so bonding with her more is actually worthless. So, reduces the SP cost of recovery skills by 25% of their normal cost. Or 225%. So there we go. We're only spending one-fourth of um, SP cost for her healing skills. Woo! Awesome. So we officially got... Yukari to a, a level that is good. So now it's pretty much just Akihiko and Fuka and then um, pretty much everyone else that follows afterwards. But there we go. That's awesome. Lots of healing. It just sucks that she's severely under leveled at the moment. Okay, today is Saturday. I'm gonna save here. Just in case I need to do the shrine. If I need to do the shrine to deepen my bond with the hermit. Because I don't know if I can deepen my bond with the hermit or not. Okay. I'm just going to deepen my bond with the justice. So yeah. Healing Apex. Awesome. Okay, so if I need to deepen my bond with um, with the Hermit, then I'll do so at the Shrine, so that way I can max out her rank right away. Okay, I guess I'll do Akihiko again, just so I can gain his ability. <clears throat> okay, so he might gain a new ability soon, so let's watch it. Okay, so buff boost or increases the effects of buffs on self. So that might be useful later down the road, but who knows. Alright, Sunday. So we're gonna see if we can bomb with the Hermit. Screw you guys, I don't want to uh, spend time with you. If we can't bond with the Hermit, then we'll raise um, her rank at the Shrine. Okay, let me see. Oh, no, we can't. We can't. See, we can't rank up. Good to know. I'm glad I thought ahead beforehand because we're going to reload the save and go back. And we're going to use the Shrine to deepen our bond with the Hermit. Now, I'm pretty sure we go here, right? So I'm going to save here. I just got to make sure that I actually get a good fortune. Okay, online game. Alright, so I should be able to deepen my bond with her. Awesome. Fair luck. And I gained more money from it, so that was a good fortune. Well, I'm not too concerned about the textureless NPCs. I'm really not concerned about them whatsoever. Alright, so let me get the um, 
buff uh, increase with Akihiko. And hopefully I'm able to deepen my bomb with the Hermit, because I want to be able to max her out right away. And then I just gotta fuse Naga again and make sure that I can get um, Invigorate 1. If I can get Invigorate 1, then I have a chance of being able to progress through the game efficiently. Screw you guys, I ain't bothering with you. But yeah, the next full moon is definitely going to be a tough one. Okay, hold on. Alright, good, so we can bond with Maya. Awesome. But first, let me just, um, save and make sure that I can buy whatever I need from the Tanaka show. Abba Chocolate? What's the Abba Chocolate for? Not bad, kid. Doctor and Jelly, too? I have no idea what these are for, but screw it, I'll buy it. Why not? <clears throat> and there we go. Maxed out the Hermit, so hopefully this will give me uh, Naga with um, Invigorate 1. <coughs> I'll miss you. And there we go, the Hermit Arcana is completely maxed. I'm actually getting pretty fast through this. Now I'm sad that I'd be in the game, I should have played fast if I'm ever bored. I'll go ahead. And there we go, Hermit maxed out, so hopefully we can get Nago with Invigorate 1. And we could use uh, Arahapaki, nice, however you pronounce that. And there we go, we will never see our online girlfriend ever again. Okay, before we jump into Tartarus, let me uh, go up the stairs first. So we're gonna jump into Tartarus tonight, but first we're just gonna go to the stations. Get our SP recovery drinks, and then make sure that we're fully ready to take on, um, whatever we need to take on. Alright, sweet. <clears throat> oh, wait, hold on. Before I go, uh, let me just go to the mall, Club Escapade. Actually, I may not have enough yen. I'm not sure how much yen I spent. Oh, no, I got enough yen. Increase my theurgy. So, Soul Fortune to increase my Theurgy Gauge. There we go. Alright. <clears throat> So now it's time to jump into Tartarus. So I gotta refuse Naga again. Alright, good. But yeah, definitely really glad that I was able to max out the Hermit. You guys are so bugged about the textureless NPCs, and I personally just don't care. 
Oh yeah, this missing person is probably gonna die, guys. Okay, anyway, so, um... Oh my god, fuck off, uh, Microsoft. I don't care about my problems right now. Okay, so let me just see here. <clears throat> so I need to fuse Naga away, that's right now the main goal. Fuse Naga away. Actually, what floor is the missing person even on? Floors... 48 to 53, and we're nowhere near those floors. So yeah, this person is probably gonna die. This person's probably gonna die. <laughs> Very well. I feel like Vox from uh, Hasman Hotel, like, <laughs> they're gonna die. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're gonna die. <laughs> Alright, so I just gotta fuse Naga away and then refuse Naga. Okay. Before you insert, please choose the personas you would like to fuse. Uh, okay, it seems like the only fusion I can make is Captain Kid, so I guess I'll go with that. This persona is powerful. What do you wish to inherit? Now, uh, let me see here. Counter. Provoke. Rage Boost. And Growth Wander Marin Karen. Hmm. Actually, no. Fire break. It, appears. it will receive an immense amount of power. It's finally time. So there we go. We got... We fused a Persona 5 Persona. But yeah, I'm allowing the use of DLC Personas. There we go, we got Captain Kid with us. Awesome. So now we gotta refuse Naga again. What kind of persona do you desire? Okay, so here's Mitra. So this is the persona that I got on the request that I need to fuse, so I need to be level 22 to fuse him. Okay. Which will you choose? Okay, so now I just need to figure out um, how to refuse Naga again, so. Okay, Persona Calculator. Persona 3 Reload Calculator. List of Personas. Shut up, Igor. Okay, hold on. So, Naga is level, um, whatever's. Okay. So, who do I have here? Um. Do I have Jack Lantern? No, I don't. Uh, let's see, who do I have? Take all the time you need to consider. Shut up. Okay, um. Okay, I got Archangel, so Archangel and um I don't have Nico Shogun yet. Okay, so, uh, who was it? Um, Archangel and, uh, that one persona that I just fused away. This is your progress so far. It was in death, right? So, this guy. Oh, it seems you can't afford the fee. Oh my god, of course I am low on freaking funds, because fuck you, game. Ah! God damn it. Okay, so it looks like I need to do some Tartarus grinding for money before I can fuse Naga. Which thankfully shouldn't be a problem because I can just gain some money from chess. I should be able to get the money that I need from chess. So 
So I'm just going to start from the beginning because at least I know I can um, gain a decent amount of money from just chess alone. So it looks like I'm going through Thebel again. Okay, nice. So hopefully we gain some yen because that's our main goal is to get yen. Alright, there we go. Good start. We just need to get over 5,000 yen. Speed ban. One teleporter sighted. They'll take us back to the entrance, but I'm down to keep going. Careful, the enemy's nearby. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Sweet. But yeah, even though Fuka will be a possible reliance for um, for increasing our uh, chances of being able to restore SP, we'll pretty much only use that or use our theurgy if we want to restore SP. But we have to also consider the chance that she may just give the entire party an old party heat riser. But alternatively, if we use Makoto's Theurgy to buff everyone's agility, then that might decrease the chances of her using the Heat Riser. I trust you're not tired. Then let's be off. Hot Merciful, come on, I need more Yen game. There was a time. Alright. Yeah. <clears throat> I just need a little over a thousand yen and I should be good. That teleporter can take us to the entrance. Try to remember where it is. Shadow spotted. What's the plan? And if I need to get more yen, I could just do a random battle and hopefully get the uh koi card through shuffle time. That'll be another way to get money. Oh, yes! Okay, so we should have the money that we need, but we'll just uh, fully explore Thebel first before we fuse Naga. We'll just explore Thebel first before we fuse Naga. Open it up and get a soul drop, sweet. That chest. <clears throat> There's a treasure chest. What should we do? All right, we got more than enough yen to get exactly what we need. But I'll just explore all the Thebel just so I can get every single thing that is available in all the chests. Invigorate 1 hype. Well, hopefully we can get Invigorate 1 without having to grind more because Invigorate 1 is literally the last skill that Naga has. Okay. 
running around like a clown. Okay, I got my fast travel point, but I'll get to that once I explore the other floors. I think we've seen everything on this floor by now. All right. But yeah, hopefully we could get Invigorate 1 right away without having to grind more. Because if we have to grind more, then it might take a while before we could even get Invigorate 1. But yeah, if we get Invigorate 1, then we can pretty much uh, just go to low-level enemies and pretty much just guard until we eventually fully restore our SP or whatever. That might be a method that we may have to use, but we'll see. That teleporter can take us to the Okay, power band, which is some money that we can get if I sell that. It seems like we've checked everything on this floor. Mm. Alright. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Okay, it's a locked one, so I'm gonna ignore it. Distress or dis distress? That's a mouthful. A but yeah, part of me wonders if I should probably like uh, grind until um, until um, Junpei learns a counter, just so I can have that extra edge um, in the Tartarus fight. Alternatively, if I just keep him alive and defeat the Tartarus Guardian, then I can, um, then I can definitely level him up that way. It'll be a lot faster, but, yeah. It's gonna be three SP per turn, but you know what? It's a lot better than relying on Fuka's Theurgy. So it's not only does it take forever to restore, but there's a chance that she may use Heat Riser instead of, um, SP Recovery. And I think as long as we keep everyone fully healed, that she won't heal our SP. Or HP, I mean. Press down on the control stick. <laughs> oh, there's a treasure chest. Not gonna get it. That chest doesn't look like the others. Yep, it doesn't look like the others, so maybe we should avoid it. Get it pretty close to finishing the ball. We're doing well. Let's keep up the pace. So yeah, plus three SP is going to stock up. Oh yeah, having a having invigorated general is just going to be a huge uh, t uh, scale tipper for us. Even though it's only three SP per turn, it's going to be a huge benefit. You shouldn't have any trouble on 
this floor. But please be careful regardless. Man, yeah, Fuka is so caring. I'm probably not going to fight the Charter's Guardian during the stream just because it's getting too late on my side. Yeah, I'm probably not going to fight the Charter's Guardian since it's getting too late on my side, but I'm definitely going to end it when I eventually get the Invigorate skill. Oh shoot, wrong button. Okay, time to move on then. Yep. <coughs> oh jeez. Great. Yay, rare shadow that we can't get. But yeah, we'll see how many Tartarus Guardians we can do uh, tonight. But uh, once I get Invigorate, I'm definitely going to make the attempt to try to get at least um, uh, the first one in Arc 1 done. Because at this point, I might as well turn this into a mand mandatory battles only challenge. Is it? Those teleporters allow us to save both time <clears throat> and energy. Oh, I... Hey, there's a trick. Luck band, cool. All good. I guess so. Oh, there's a treasure chest. I'll be compiling a report of everything we observe on this expedition. I'll help too. <clears throat> Hopefully, we learn something from all of this. I just gotta make my way to uh, the stairs, which is over here. A shadow. What will you do? I will kiss it and marry it, and maybe have sex with it. What do you think I'm gonna do, Mitsuru? Can we go up those stairs? More yen, awesome. All right, more yen the better. Ah, here we go. Now let's return to the entrance. <clears throat> And now we can see if we can finally fuse Naga. So what was the persona that I needed to fuse uh, or, or take? I'm pretty sure it was the uh, death persona, right? Whatever its name was. But yeah, I fuse Archangel with um, whatever its name is. And then that should give me... Uh, that should give me Naga again. <clears throat> Please take a look. 
So I just need death. Please, so you'll be summoning this one. May it be your inner strength. Uh, which will you choose? And here we go. We can refuse Naga again. So let's do this. Oh, I can actually do this. Um, hold on. Uh, who's better, Counter Growth One and Rakunda? This would be a wise choice. Hold on. Um, Counter Growth One doesn't have Rakunda, but does have Fire Break. Hold on. Okay, I think I'll fuse Archangel away. Please choose what skills to inherit. Alright, so I need counter, fire break. Uh Rakuda, I could pretty much have Mitsuru in charge of that. Growth one. And uh either Mary Karen or Rakunda. Um I don't know. I guess Marin Karen, because I I could have I could just have Mitsuru in charge of Rakunda. It appears it will receive an. <laughs> and yep, it's gonna learn all of its skills. So here we go, guys. It's official. We have finally got the skill that we needed. In Big Red One, I'm just gonna let this cutscene play out. Oh, yes, I'm so happy. And we did it, guys. It took so freaking long, but we finally got the first in Big Rain 1 skill, and the only one that we can actually get from a Persona. Apparently, Naga is the only Persona that has Invigorate 1. But we freaking finally did it. We finally have Invigorate 1. It's official. Invigorate 1, we have it. Goddamn did that take forever, but we freaking did it. Ah. Now I'm going to see if there's any forward fusions that I can do with Naga just so I can move the Invigorate around. Or maybe I should just keep it on Naga for now because Naga's kind of, um... You know what? Naga's actually a pretty good persona considering that uh, they resist electric. Yeah, I think I might keep this persona for now. And I don't have enough money to get the other personas anyway, so. We look Imagine if it was a fusion accident. Well, if so, then I would just uh, reload my previous save. Alright, so I think I'm gonna attempt the Tartarus Guardian next time because I'm pretty sure it's gonna take me a really long time to get through the Tartarus Guardian, so what I'm gonna do instead is just go through, um, the available floors of Thebel, and then I will attempt the, um, oh man, three people are gonna die, guys. Three people are gonna freaking die. But yeah, I'm gonna definitely, uh, try to beat, um, the Tartarus Guardian within this day, but I'm gonna do that next stream. Right now, I'm just going to complete um, and, uh, as much as I can of um, Arqua. Just get uh, all the chests and money and soul drops and whatever as much as I can. Pretty much just clear some ways here.
So I'm just gonna make my way up to where the Tartar's Guardian is, and that'll be the end of the stream, guys. I mean, as much as I would love to stream more and show a actual successful attempt against, um, against, uh, whatever the name of the Tartar's Guardians are, I'm pretty confident that I am able to beat them. I'm pretty confident I am able to beat them as long as I have that Invigorate skill on me. And, of course, um, have Fuka as a backup for SP Restorative. <coughs> but yeah, I'm not sure how far I'll get into Tartarus um, before I do the full moon operation. I mean, one thing's for sure is that I want to level Yukari up more so that way she's a little bit more prepared because I'm forced to use her during the next full moon operation. And I definitely want to get the skill counter onto, um, onto Junpei. So, I'll see what it is. Dark Charm, not useful, but whatever. We got it out of the way. That teleporter can take us to the entrance. Try to remember where it is. But yeah, I'm just clearing the way all the way to the Tartarus Guardian, and then I'm gonna defeat it. Defeat it next stream, because I just I'm just running out of time. And I'm pretty sure it's going to take me like a good hour or so just to get through the next Tartarus Guardian. So that'll be the next stream is the Tartarus Guardian, but this time with a Invigorate 1 passive skill on me. So I'll be able to restore 3 SP per turn whenever it's Makoto's turn. Is it efficient? No, but honestly it's better than grinding for soul drops and a bunch of other crap just to make this run possible. And of course, while we're at it, just try to get as many soul drops as possible. Like, how many soul drops do we got? Ooh, eight soul drops. So yeah, I just use that and then just save the four biotic pack and the snuff soul for the full moon operation. A rare shadow and a valuable chest. I mean, the valuable chest sounds nice. All right, more money. A shadow. What will you do? <coughs> we don't. Bomb of life. That might be helpful. At least the shadow itself can't hit me. There's no room for carelessness. Stay alert. <clears throat> yep, next full moon is gonna be spicy. Unfortunately, you're right about that. It's a treasure chest. But don't worry, Makoto's gonna lose his virginity one way or another. There's the end, so I just need to get this one mineral deposit here. Just in case it's a soul drop. <clears throat> um. And here we go, we made it to the end. I'm getting a faint read of a person, it could be one who got lost in here. Yeah, I know, but unfortunately they might die, Fuka. They might freaking die. I mean, we pretty much have access to all of Arqua. But we haven't even got past the first goddamn Tartarus Guardian of Arqua. It just shows you just how bad this run is. Alright, so that's going to be the end of this stream, guys, unfortunately. I mean, as much as I would love to stream more, that's going to be the end. 
So here we go. We got not him equipped. We got uh, where is he? Where where? Hold on. No, got to go to personas. Hold on. So Naga equipped. Invigorate one counter with a resistance to um, electricity, which is going to be helpful. So pretty much I'll be switching to Naga whenever I need to use Fire Break and whenever I need to invigorate my SP. But yeah, this is definitely going to be the ultimate tail skipper of the uh, or the the ultimate scale tipper of the run is Invigorate One. It only restores three SP per turn, but you know what? It's better than relying on Fuka for her theurgy to take forever to heal up, just for her to cast a Heat Riser and not an SP restorative. So. Yeah. So hopefully with Invigorate 1, this should be enough for us to get past most, if not maybe all, of the Tartarus Guardians. Maybe I'll do as much of Arqua as possible, but maybe when I get to a certain point, I might save the rest of Arqua for later, because I might be spending a very, very long time in Arqua. Of course, I do have enough Twilight Fragments to fully restore SP on everyone else if everyone else loses too much SP, but um, hopefully I won't need to resort to that. So, this is going to be the ultimate uh, tail... Uh, ta I keep on saying tail skipper for whatever reason. Scale tipper for hopefully the fights to come. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this stream. So when I do the next stream, I'm going to fight the Tartarus Guardian again, but this time with the Invigorate 1 skill, and hopefully that will be the ultimate skill that will get me through the fight faster, because I definitely have the Personas to endure the damage taken, for sure. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this, and I'll see you guys in the next... Um, uh, stream on It's a Gamer where we ultimately fight the Tartarus Guardian and, ho and hopefully make actual progress in Arqua for once. So thank you guys so much for watching and yeah, I maxed out three social links. So yeah, I am definitely making a lot of progress in this run, thankfully. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next stream. Au revoir, have a good day or night or whatever your time is and adios. Happy April, everyone. Oh, and just for the record, I don't have a job at Atlas West. That was an April Fool's joke, by the way. Okay? I don't have a job at Atlas West for as awesome as that would be. That was an April Fool's joke. So thank you guys so much for watching, and au revoir.